Great Voyage, The Cartoonist of the Straw Hats Chapter 151 Frankie, we have to change the ship, please subscribe. Although Garp said he wanted to catch the pirates, he just fixed Luffy and left. The banquet is over, and it's time for the Straw Hat pirates to embark on a journey. But, when Frankie looked at going merry carefully, he said to everyone with a serious face, we have to change a ship. Usopp suddenly shouted, hey, 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 what are you talking about? Luffy also widened his eyes. Are you talking about changing ships? Stop joking. The others also frowned, feeling very dissatisfied with Frankie's words tilde. Damn you just joined, you have such an outrageous idea. Liu Olan also frowned. In the original plot, the melee was too small to withstand the toss of the big wind and waves, so it finally stopped in the capital of Seven Waters. But the current Merry is not that little one. Today's bell is at least twenty times the size of the original Melly. Although it can't be compared with those super battleships, it can be regarded as a big ship anyway. Why does it need to be replaced? But dot 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 he also understands Frankie's personality. He is indeed a shipwright with extraordinary talent 833. Since he said that, there must be his reasons. Immediately, Liu Olan also looked at Frankie suspiciously. Merry is fine, why change it? It can be seen that this ship was very attentive when I saw it. Frankie rubbed his chin looked at going merry, and commented seriously, it's just that the material used for the construction should be sorrel wood that grows in the temperate zone. Zora nodded, it's indeed sorb wood. Luffy picked her nostrils, I seem to have an impression too tilde. Nami said seriously, it's not the impression, it's the mountain pear wood. It's the best wood around Xeliwabu village. When the going merry was built, the three of them participated in the shipbuilding site, so they were very impressed with the Imanati wood. That kind of tree is really strong as a material, but its impact resistance is not strong. If you just do things like fishing in the sea, then this kind of wood is more than enough. But if you have to face strong winds and waves for a long time, this kind of material will last a long time. There will be problems. As he spoke, Frankie walked to the bow of the boat and tapped the hull with his fingers one by one. Then, he deduced, from the sound, there are small cracks inside the hull. If I'm not wrong, the ship must have suffered some kind of strong impact before causing the whole body of the hull to suffer damage. Strong shaking. At first, everyone was very angry at what Frankie said just now, but now seeing Frankie's professional appearance, he suddenly felt that he was not talking nonsense. If it hits, Liu Olan immediately understood. It seems that it was the time when the sea current surged into the sky. Although Liu Olan had the ability of a shield at that time, he couldn't use the shield when the sky current hit the bottom of the ship. Otherwise, the soaring ocean current would be blocked by the energy barrier of the shield and would not be able to become the driving force for the Golden Mary to fly to the Sky Island. It's just that he never expected that Huang Jinmai would be hurt so much that time. Ah! It's a sea current. Luffy opened his mouth wide, with an expression of sudden realization on his face. At that time, we were rushed into the air at a height of 7,000 meters by the soaring ocean current. The impact must have been quite large. Nani? Question mark. 7,000 meters? Frankie looked at Luffy with disdain. So you are a braggart. There is no doubt that it is true. We really reached the Sky Island at an altitude of 7,000 meters through the soaring current. Liu Olan took out a video shell, clicked it, and saw the scene of Sky Island appearing on it. Oh, oh, oh. Frankie's A's lit up. There is such a magical place. Let's talk about the Mary first. Liu Olan put away the video shell. Okay dot 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 okay. Frankie came back to his senses, and he continued, Now the ship can hold on, but if it suffers from a few more waves or shelling, it will risk disintegration. But, aren't you a shipbuilder? Can't you solve this problem? Sanji asked with a heavy emotion. Usopp also laughed and said, yeah, now that I have you, this kind of small problem should be very simple for you. Frankie waved his hand, stop joking, I'm a shipbuilder. But I'm not a god. The current situation of this ship is, what I want to say is, the whole ship is made of sorrel wood, including the keel. Do you understand? Keel. Hearing this word, Liu Olan suddenly felt his scalp explode. I remember that in the original plot. The Golden Mary was unable to continue sailing because of a broken keel. Will we now have to change ships again for this reason? For this situation, Liu Lan was really not mentally prepared. Let's not listen to this. Red underpants. Take back what you just said. The Mary is obviously fine. Bastard, you did it on purpose. Do you have to say something so outrageous to show how good you are at shipbuilding? The members of the Straw Hat Pirates were unwilling to accept such a situation, and they began to criticize loudly Tilda. Tilda. Liu Lan sighed slightly in his heart Tilda. He understands the big geese mood very well. After all, if you can't solve the problem, then get rid of the person who found the problem. This is a traditional virtue. Is there no way to remedy it? What if it is reinforced? At this time, Zora asked seriously. It can be said that Zora is always the one who can keep calm every time he encounters chaos. Frankie patted his head, and said with some emotion, Since you participated in the construction process of this ship, you should understand that the only thing on the whole ship that cannot be strengthened is the keel, because the whole ship is built based on the keel of. Of course Zoro understands, it's just that it's hard for him to accept this kind of thing. No. The Mary is our partner, 
we cannot abandon him. Luffy's face is serious. He is very serious when he is angry. That's right. I firmly support Luffy's decision. You so praised his fist and expressed his opinion. Liu Olan pouted slightly tilde. Hash. In the original plot, when Luffy made the decision to change the ship, you could become the only black spot in the history of the Straw Hat Pirates. There must be a way to remedy it. Nami's eyes are glowing red. She is also one of the people who participated in the construction of Melee, and naturally has a very deep bond with Melee. Liu Olan took a deep breath, and then asked, If you continue sailing, where do you think the Melee can last? If you don't suffer heavy shelling or the impact of a tsunami, the first half of the Grand Line will be fine. But if you want to enter the New World, you must pass the Fisherman Island below 10,000 meters below the seabed. This ship will definitely bear it. Can't stand that pressure. Frankie gave the answer. It can. The Mary will definitely be able to. We have all sailed such a long distance, and it will definitely be able to persist. Usopp didn't seem to be listening to what Frankie said at all, just talking to himself. What to do, Luffy? Zora looked at Luffy with a heavy look on his face. Seeing that Luffy didn't speak, he looked at Liu Ogang again. What should I do? If you are willing to listen to me, let's build the best ship in the world while we are in the capital of Seven Waters. I have already inquired about the black market information of Bozu Adam. It used to be the pirate ship of the pirate King Roger. It was built from the wood of the precious tree Adam. Frankie started giving Amway to everyone. He looked at Luffy. Luffy, don't you want to become the One Piece? Then in terms of the standard of the pirate ship, you must at least be on par with the previous One Piece. If this is really the case, then, considering the rationality of 0 0.9, it is a rational choice to change the ship. Robin took a sip of the red pine side. Seeing that everyone in the Straw Hat Pirates seemed to be moved by him, Frankie immediately said, While the iron was hot, I'm going to get someone to contact the black market now. As long as you can get 200 million berries, we can buy the best wood in the world that is going to the black market. 200 million berries. Dot 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 we can afford this money. Hearing this, Liu Olan nodded. Money is not a problem. But, but, give us a little more time. Mary is not just our pirate ship, in a sense, he has become our partner. Exclamation mark. Breathing heavily and shaking his head, Liu Olan gritted his teeth. Everyone is upset now, so let's not go out to sea today. Everyone think about it, and we will discuss this matter tomorrow. After speaking. Liu Lan walked towards the cabin. Chapter 152 The Fourth Treasure Chest, Ship Spirit Fruit. Please subscribe. Back in the studio, Liu Lan sat on the chair distraught. As early as when he was in Xiluobu village, Liu Lan thought about the situation before him. In order to avoid this kind of thing from happening, it can be said that it took out all the wealth of the family and built the most expensive melee at that time. But who would have thought? Even so, the body of the Golden Mary is still too weak tilde. It's a matter of material. It can't be solved by any means. Wait until we have to say goodbye to the Mary in the capital of Seven Waters like in the original plot. But the problem is, in the situation in the original plot, the Golden Mary is already dilapidated, and it will fall apart if it is not replaced. The current going Mary has cracks on the inside, but the surface is still intact. It's like telling you that a beautiful little girl is actually terminally ill. Who can accept this? Question mark. Damn it. The more he thought about it, the more bored he became. Liu Olan kicked the wall. But after kicking, Liu Olan suddenly felt guilty. Ah Tilda I'm sorry, Mli, I didn't want to kick you. After a while, Liu Olan sat down again. I don't know what to do. I turned on the system reflexively, and checked the system mail. I have also stayed in the capital of Seven Waters for several days, and sure enough, there are still new system emails. Question mark your manga fan Nami conquered shadow card in the manga? Card Kaptisura? world. You simultaneously gain the shadow card ability. You get points plus two. Question mark your fans Sanji cultivated the sixth floor of eight inner gates in the comic book? Guy Emperor Biography? The sixth floor of eight inner gates vertical bar successfully opened the sixth most gate. You simultaneously acquire the ability of the sixth village gate. You get 08 points plus 51. Question mark your manga fan Ace has practiced the third layer of flame dragon slaying magic in the world of the manga? Fire Dragon Natsu You simultaneously acquire the third layer of Fire Dragon Magic ability. You get points plus five. Your fan Nico Robin has improved his world strength in the comic, use Yumaki Naruto biography, and practiced B-level Ninjutsu Shadow Clone technique. You simultaneously obtain the B-level Ninjutsu Shadow Clone technique. You get plus two points. Question mark. Your fan Nico Robin has improved his world strength in the comic, use Yumaki Naruto biography and he has cultivated a B-level ninjutsu. You simultaneously obtain the B-level ninjutsu mind-bounding technique. You get plus two points, question mark. Nami can really be called a model worker tilde. Every time I open the system email, there is her, and the shadow card obtained this time is also a very good ability. In addition, Robin obviously has a tendency to come from behind, but if you think about it carefully, Robin's way of training is indeed very efficient for practicing ninjutsu. After such a long time of suffering, Sanji finally opened the eight inner gates to the sixth Simon. In this way, his combat power can finally enter the T1 line of this world. Phrase. Dot. 
Liu Olan had only one idea. The fact that he can still receive his system mail means that he did not drown in the sea. If it were normal, Liu Olan would be in a very good mood every time after receiving the system email. Tilda. But this time, because of the incident on the Mary, I couldn't feel better. After closing the system mail interface, Liu Olan casually looked at the main interface again. Um, the achievement drawer is on again. It seems that a treasure chest can be opened again. Open the score achievement interface, and sure enough, the icon of the fourth treasure chest is lit. Compared with the third treasure chest, this fourth treasure chest is still golden, but there are some mysterious lines engraved on the top of the treasure chest. It looks taller than pure gold. Without too much hesitation, Liu Lan opened the fourth treasure chest. The golden light is blooming, and the sense of ceremony is still in place. In a flash of dazzling light, a fruit full of mysterious patterns jumped out of the treasure chest. Devil fruit. Liu Lan frowned tilde. I don't know what kind of devil fruit the system will give. Logically speaking, this is already the fourth treasure chest, and its value must be at least higher than the first three treasure chests. Judging from the rewards given by the third treasure box, if the devil fruit given by the fourth treasure box is not of the phantom beast species, then it will be worthless for the value of the fourth treasure box. Liu Olan checked the information of this devil fruit. Boat spirit fruit, possesses the heaven-defying ability that can integrate the ship spirit and the hull itself. Question mark. How to use, just touch the ship spirit fruit to any position of the ship. Question mark. Conditions of use, the ship must have produced the ship spirit to have the effect, otherwise, once the fruit is used, it will be invalid. Question mark. What? Question mark. Looking at the introduction of this devil fruit, Liu Olan suddenly realized that this devil fruit was not for him, but for the boat. But. The conditions are very harsh. It must be the ship produced by the elf's ship when using this demon will have an effect, otherwise it will be given for nothing. For example, now that Liu Olan randomly finds a small wooden boat that has just been built, and integrates this devil fruit into the small wooden boat, it will not have any effect. And the used devil fruit cannot be recycled! Exclamation mark. Liu Olan was taken aback suddenly, and there was a look of color in his eyes. Since the role of this devil fruit is to combine the legendary spirit and the hull itself, wouldn't it just say, the Golden Mary is saved? What is a ship's spirit? In simple terms, it is the spirit of the ship. If a ship is to be born with a ship elf, it must meet two conditions at the same time. First, the crew must truly care for each other. Second, the crew has extremely deep feelings for the ship. These two conditions seem to be not complicated, but in fact they are very difficult to achieve. The sea is so big, it is almost never heard of a ship elf appearing on any ship. In people's eyes, the ship elves are just things that exist in Legend Stilda. If the above two conditions are fulfilled, the boat will turn into a person like a crew member holding a mallet and wearing a raincoat. It sounds like a ship is a ship elf, and a ship elf is a ship, but Liu Olan, who has watched One Piece, knows that the ship spirit is more like a crew member on a ship. Even if the ship breaks down, it can only work hard to repair it. But the ability of this devil fruit can make the boat spirit equals boat. Liu Olan can probably guess that it should be in the same form as Kaponbig's body and the big castle. Kaponbig is the great castle, and the great castle is Kaponbig. Of course, everything is still unknown until the devil fruit is actually used. With the thought of Liu Olan, the ship spirit fruit appeared in his hand. Today, the golden melee is terribly ill. Liu Olan is not sure whether this devil fruit is really capable of turning the tide. B. I can't just watch going merry parting like this tilde. Liu Olan squatted down slowly, holding the ship spirit fruit in his hand. He looked at the ground and called out with emotion, Meli, if you really have awakened, please respond to me. The next moment, Liu Olan seemed to feel the hull tremble slightly tilde. It's merry. That feeling, definitely not from the crew. Instead a response from going merry. In the original plot, going merry had already appeared as a ship elf in Sky Island. But now because the protection along the way is very good, so I haven't heard anyone mention seeing the ship spirit repairing the ship. Liu Olan is not sure whether the ship elf is produced or not Tilda, but when he sensed Going Merry's response, he understood, Going Merry must have produced the consciousness of the ship elf, but it should have just been produced, so it cannot be transformed into a villain wearing a raincoat and rain boots like in the original plot. Thinking of this, Liu Olan didn't hesitate anymore. He gently placed the ship spirit fruit on the floor. I saw that the fruit of the ship spirit suddenly burst into a strange colorful light. The entire devil fruit turned into a streamer, gradually sinking into the hull. Next moment Tilda, on the floor in front of Liu Olan, golden lines bloom continuously, outlining the shape of a child in a raincoat Tilda. Could it be that the ship spirit fruit hastened the awakening of the ship spirit? Seeing this scene, Liu Olan secretly guessed in his heart. After a while, the golden light gradually solidified and a cute little girl in a yellow raincoat and holding a mallet appeared. Dot. Liu Olan said with some trepidation in his heart. After all, this is the first time he has seen a ship elf, and he doesn't know if it is Melly Tilda. May dot 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 may dot 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 Mary. A milky voice came out of the cute mouth. The moment she looked up, 
Lero Lance saw her face, exquisite little ally like a porcelain doll. If judged by the appearance of a human being, it is about the size of a six or seven year old child Tilda, only. Judging from her words, it seems like a two or three year old baby. Mom, Mom, Mom. Xiaomili opened her arms and planned to hug Liu Olan Tilda 740. Puff. Why are you still calling Mommy? Just Tilda. Liu Lan felt sorry because he remembered that the ship elves were untouchable, looking at the porcelain doll in front of me and wanting to be hugged. AI gang is also very helpless Tilda. I also want to give you a hug, but the concubine can't do it. But the next moment Tilda, um, little Millie's little hand touched Liu Olan's arm. This touch, exclamation mark, etc. No way. Liu Olan looked at the little Millie in front of him, and suddenly realized one thing. FK, this ship spirit has a physical body. I see. It must be because of the ship spirit fruit. Thinking of this. Liu Lan immediately gave little Mili a big hug and picked her up. Ham Tilda. At the moment of contact, Ying Xing's information was instantly transmitted to Liu O Gang's brain Poseidon. Liu O Lan could clearly sense that this information was sent to him through the system. If I'm not mistaken, because it was the boat spirit fruit given by Liu O Lan, the little Mili in front of him had a special connection with Liu O Lan. Some of her information was completely shared with Liu O Lan. For example, Xia Mili's physical condition, hunger level, mood etc. At this time Tilda, why is this like the electronic pets I played with when I was a child? Liu Lan looked at Xiao Mili's body data, and his expression changed slightly. Because there is an injury sign shining on little Meli's data panel. Judging from the information, there are four types of injuries, white injuries, yellow injuries, powder injuries, and red injuries. At this time, the injury sign of little Meli is pink, which is obviously serious. Wait. Before Frankie said that the wood of the Golden Mary had small cracks, but now the little Mary has hinted at powder damage. Could it be that? Suddenly, a possibility emerged in Liu Olan's mind. Chopper. The next moment, Liu Olan picked up Xiao Mai and rushed out. Chapter 153 Little Millie is hungry and wants to eat Mew Mew. Please subscribe. Chopper. Chopper. Liu Olan rushed to the corridor, directly to the throat. R? I'm here. Hearing Liu Olan's urgent call, Chopper rushed over. Not only him. But the other partners also rushed over when they heard Liu Olan's hasty shout. What's wrong? Liu Olan, what happened? Huh? Where did the child come from? Everyone saw that Liu Olan had not left for a long time, and even hugged the child. All of them were stunned. Don't worry about it so much Tilda. Liu Olan didn't want to explain for the time being. He grabbed Chopper. Quick, take a look at little Mili's body. Can it be healed? Aha Tilda, her name is little Mili. Luffy's A's lit up. This name. It seems that Liu Olan is the one who hates going merry the most and actually named his child Xiao Mary. Yeah, I just don't know where this child came from. Amidst everyone's discussion, Liu Lan and Chopper went to the medical room. After the examination, Chopper said with a distressed face, It's so pitiful, she was seriously injured. Can it be cured? Liu Lan asked hastily. Yes, and the injury is not difficult to treat. As he spoke, Chopper took out his toolbox, and asked Liu o Gang to put Little Mliping down. However, when Little Mili saw Chopper taking out Takapuncha, she was frightened and threw herself into Liu Olan's arms again. Don't be afraid, don't be afraid, Chopper is healing you. Gently stroking little Melly's back, Liu Olan comforted her. But little Melly was still huddled in Liu Olan's arms, holding Liu Olan's clothes nervously with her two little hands. Or you can hold her, as long as she doesn't move around. Chopper held the acupuncture and said in a low voice, That's okay. Liu Olan found a comfortable angle and sat down. Watching Chopper start acupuncture. Chopper's acupuncture and the moxi bustion is not as messy as the old Chinese medicine practitioners on the earth tilde. There were only five needles in total, and the medicine was applied to the needles. After a while, little Mary fell asleep. Luffy poked his head in through the doorway, bared and asked, Can he come in? Liu Olan glanced at the sleeping little Mli, then used his spiritual power to cover his ears, and then said, Come in. Wow, Liu Olan. Who is this kid? Luffy asked loudly as soon as he came in. Duang. Nami landed on his head with one punch and scolded, stupid Luffy, keep your voice down, didn't you see that cutie is sleeping, Liu Lan said, it doesn't matter, I have blocked his ears with my ability, it won't wake him up, what the hell is going on here, Sanji also asked curiously, Liu Lan looked at everyone and asked, have you ever heard of the legend of elves, boat spirit, everyone, look at me and I look at you, with confused expressions on their faces, but there is one person who is different, that is Frankie, his eyes lit up, boat elf, ah, this kid is wearing a yellow raincoat and rain boots, and is holding a mallet in his hand dot 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 wait she dot 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 she 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 dot 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 couldn't it be dot 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 the ship spirit ye Liu Lan nodded yes she is the ship elf of the golden mary hey 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 what is an elf what do you mean why do only you two know everyone realizes something and is even more eager to be popularized as soon as possible the ship spirit is at this time Frankie began to popularize science for everyone. After Frankie's popular science was over, everyone in the Straw Hat Pirates was in shock. Boat spirit, not one in a billion exists. However, 
they were met by the Straw Hat Pirates, or it was the Straw Hat Pirates who awakened the ship's spirit. But, at this time, Frankie rubbed his chin, with a confused expression on his face. Shouldn't the ship's spirit be seen but not imitated? Why can this child be held by you? I couldn't touch her when I saw her before, but I used some abilities to make some changes to her. In short, she is going Mary's ship elf, and she is a living existence just like us. Liu Olan explained. Hearing this, Frankie was even more shocked. What? Can you do this to a ship elf? Usopp replied immediately. If it is Liu Olan, he can indeed do many things that people think are impossible. Nami also nodded. That's right. Although this kind of thing sounds outrageous. But if Liu Olan did it, it's not too outrageous. Her back is acupuncture, right? Why is she hurt? Looking at the acupuncture being added behind little Millie, Robin's face showed maternal concern. Liu Olan's face was heavy. Her injury is actually our fault Tilda. Blame us, Luffy, Usopp, and Chopper tilt their heads at the same time Tilda. The sky is full of question marks. Yes, Frankie said that when going to Sky Island, the strong impact of the soaring current shattered going Mary's hull, and little Mary was injured at that time. Speaking of this, Liu Lan looked down at the sleeping little Mealy, and touched her head with some distress. Luffy didn't understand, and asked in confusion, What do you mean? The hull of Going Merry was shattered, what does it have to do with little Merry's injury? Why are you so stupid? Sanji made a vicious murlock mouth to Luffy with a look of disgust. Don't you understand yet? The injury on the boat we were on was the injury of little Millie. Luffy said unconvinced, isn't it? Sanji is the only one who thinks so. Look, everyone is silent. Everyone showed a speechless expression. Is not it? Still not giving up. Luffy scratched his head and asked everyone. Of course not, idiot, you are the only one who thinks that. We can all hear it, okay. Luffy's perseverance finally won him a meal of scolding from everyone Tilda. Wait a moment. At this time, Robin suddenly spoke, with some excitement on her face. She looked at Liu Olan and asked, if the wound on Xiaomai's body is healed by Chopper, then the hull of our going merry. I didn't say anything later, because Robin also felt that the situation was too unrealistic. But full of hope, Liu Olan smiled and said, if there are no accidents, when little Mary's injury is cured, our going Mary will be back to normal. Really? Wow, that's great. Mary is saved. Wow ha ha. That night, little Mary slept like a pig. In desperation, Liu Lan could only hold her and sit there all night. Early the next morning, Liu Lan felt someone pulling his mouth. When he woke up, he saw little Mary playing with his face vigorously. This vigor, isn't it cured already? Thinking of this, Liu Lan immediately checked little Melly's property panel. Um, the original pink injury icon now turned green representing health. Chopper. Soon, everyone came. After the examination, Chopper said happily, It's amazing. Little Melly's recovery speed is really fast. Frankie. Quick, check the hull of the Mary. After confirming that Melee's injury is indeed healed, Liu Lan looked at Frankie again. Good. Frankie lay on the ground directly, put his ears on the ground, and tapped lightly with his fingers. Luffy also followed him lying next to Frankie. After knocking a few times, Frankie's A's showed a look of horror Tilda. Then, he moved forward close to the ground, knocking and listening. The more he knocked, the more excited he was, until his head hit the bulkhead and the food stopped. It's amazing, it's amazing. Frankie jumped up and yelled in shock, it's all back up. Now the boat is like new. Wow. The crew of the Straw Hat Pirates all jumped up excitedly. When Frankie was beating just now, Everyone raised their hearts to their throats, and they didn't even dare to take a breath. Hearing Frankie's affirmation at this time, he shouted excitedly. At this time, Xiaomili hugged Liu Olan and shouted, Hungry, Dad, hungry, hungry, puff. Everyone was sure, and immediately exclaimed, Dad? Exclamation mark. Hey, don't be so weird about your focus, okay? She's hungry now. Liu Olan's head was full of black lines, and he looked at Sanji immediately. Sanji, you haven't shown your skills yet. Wow ha ha, it's cute little Millie who is hungry. Watch your Sanji uncle cook you a big meal. Sanji suddenly turned into a whirlwind Tilda. I came back in a blink of an eye and made a set of children's meals. Luffy subconsciously reached out to grab the hamburger. Snapped. Sanji kicked Luffy's hand away. Sweet little Mary. Please use. As long as the object is a woman. Nuo wangs out. Sanji becomes a gentleman and full of manners. Difficult dot 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 unpalatable. Little Melly trussed the burger with just one bite Tilda. Luffy quickly caught it, and dazzled it into his mouth Tilda. Usopp hurriedly asked, Hey, Sanji, what's the matter with you? Did you put too much salt? Sanji looked dissatisfied. How is it possible? I specialize in making children's meals. But at this time, Luffy exclaimed with enjoyment, Wow, it's so delicious. Sanji, I want more. You want a ghost? Sanji grinned angrily, and then turned his head showing the gentleman's face to look at little Millie. Don't be afraid, uncle will do something else for you. But Xiaomili hugged Liu Olan and shouted, Mew dot 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 eat me dot 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 eat me. Everyone was taken aback. Afterwards, Nami showed a look of surprise. Could it be that what little Millie wants to eat is wood? Everyone, you look at me, I look at you. And they all nodded vigorously. It's very possible. Wood is it. 
read. Liu Olan thought for a while, and then looked like Frankie, can you contact the seller of the piece of wood that Hui Meibao paired with Adam? Ah. Don't you mean? Hearing this, Frankie showed a surprised expression, and then excitedly shouted, okay, I'll get in touch right away. Chapter 154 Eating Adam, Melly's Attributes Saw. Please subscribe. The next day, the Golden Mary sailed to a hidden island not far from the Seven Waters. After waiting for about half an hour, a super huge cargo ship sailed on the sea. This freighter is at least the size of 30 going merry. Coming. Seeing this big ship, Frankie jumped up excitedly. This is the first thing he has done since he joined the Straw Hat Pirates, and I really hope that he will be beautiful and beautiful. Hey. Comma here it is. Frankie stood at the front of the deck, waving to the big freighter ahead. Soon, the large freighter docked beside the Golden Mary. The corners of Frankie's mouth trembled. I'm very. This week. I really have to wait, I'm really worried that you geese will run away with a deposit. Um, super. Yesterday I went to the black market island next door, and Frankie found the black market dealer who said he wanted to buy the section of the precious tree Adam's tree king. But even if it is just a section of the trunk of the precious tree Adam, its volume is very large, and it is impossible to pay for it with one hand and deliver it with one hand like buying vegetables and clothes. According to the rules of the black market, Frankie has to pay a 30% deposit first and then the black market boss will deliver the seller's goods to the buyer's designated place, and then make up the balance and deliver the goods. Now that it is finally confirmed that the seller's items have been delivered, Frankie's hanging heart relaxes. In fact, if Liu Olan hadn't given Frankie the confidence, Frankie wouldn't even have dared to hand over the 30% deposit. In front of the freighter, a muscular man with a strong figure showed a gentle smile. You can rest assured, we are an industry under the Dong Quick Sot family and our reputation is absolutely fine. Liu Olan curled her lips tilde. It turned out to be a flamenco industry tilde. Well, there is really no problem with this reputation. The muscular man glanced at the wasteland next to the Golden Mary, and asked suspiciously, are you sure you are going to unload such a good thing here? If you are willing to listen to my opinion, I suggest you contact the shipyard first. We can ship this piece of material directly to the shipyard. After all, it is Bozu Adam. It is something that can be encountered but not sought after. Even if you meet one, you must have sufficient financial resources to be eligible to get involved. But the guy in front of him wants to unload the Adam treasure tree here, isn't he this a waste of money? Question mark. No need, I'll get it myself. Liu Olan said something calmly, then stepped on his feet and shaved. His figure instantly appeared on the deck of the large freighter. The top of the deck is like the takeoff platform of an aircraft carrier, with a smooth road from front to back. Rows of huge steel frames are neatly fixed like dominoes from the sky to the back. There are huge cables hanging down from each steel frame and together they suspend a huge piece of wood in midair. Seeing this situation, Liu Olan was very satisfied. The other party did this obviously to protect the wood from wear and tear to the greatest extent. Hello. The muscular man's face changed, and his anger suddenly surged. The employees on the deck also immediately drew their knives and guns and pointed at Liu Olan in unison. Boom. Liu Olan flicked his palm forward and a large treasure chest was thrown out of the system space and landed in front of the muscular man. Relax, I'm just here to save everyone time and energy. Yag. With that said, Liu Olan put his palm on the precious tree Adam. The mind used up enough space in the system, and immediately took this section of the treasure tree Adam into it. Ah, seeing the disappearance of treasure tree Adam suddenly, the surrounding crew all exclaimed. The muscular man also froze slightly, feeling shocked. But after all, he is the representative of the Dong Quick Sot family and he has seen a lot of demon fruit power, so after being a little horrified, he quickly adjusted. My friend, although you are demon fruit power, please don't forget that we are the property of Don Quixote family. Forget it this time, it is best to follow our process in the future. The muscular man reminded with a stern face, then glanced at the big treasure box, and said, here is 170 million 10,000 berries, plus the 30 million berries you paid earlier, there is an extra 10,000 berries. As he spoke, he took out two tickets from the neatly packed baileys and handed them to the attendants beside him. The entourage took out the money, walked up to Liu Olan, and put it on with clean hands. Sir, this is the extra money. No, you can tell at a glance that there are 10,000 baileys more. Liu Olan wrinkled his face and looked at the muscular man in puzzlement. Are you making fun of me? Frankie also said loudly, Nanny, how could it be 10,000 more? That was counted by the accountant of the municipal building. This guy can really pretend. How can anyone know the amount of money just by looking at it? Sanji leaned against the frame of the boat, shook his head, and then smoked leisurely. You soap grinned and said, that's right, it's better than me. Luffy said with a naive face. He is so good. I knew that there were 10,000 baileys more. That's amazing. Chopper followed suit with a face full of admiration. Nami looked at Luffy and Chopper, turned into Murlocs and scolded. Hey, can you two be normal? You can tell he's talking nonsense. But at this time, the muscular man explained, 
I am a calculator who has eaten the fruits of calculation. Anything that needs to be calculated, I can see it at a glance. Puff. Everyone sprayed the old trough together tilde. Leo Lan looked at the other party with a sympathetic face. Ah, uh, calculate the fruit. Does this fruit have any other functions? The muscular man replied, there should be, but I haven't developed it yet. Okay, good luck tilde. Liu Olan doesn't know what to say tilde. At least dot 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 it sounds more powerful than the ordinary form of Rainran fruit. Doesn't it tilde? After accepting the 10,000 baileys, Liu Olan stepped back to going merry. Not long after, the large cargo ship in the black market disappeared on the horizon. Little Mary is crying hungry again tilde. At this time, Robin came out of the cabin holding Little Mary. What a cute little guy Tilda. Nami's eyes were full of doting, and he took Little Mary from Robin's hands. Wow, I really want to hug you too. Sanji, you soap, and Luffy stood aside, posing as if they were going to die or live Tilda. Whoa, ah. Underscore. Little Mary burst into tears. Hateful. Nami's magical fist landed, and the three of them were immediately covered. Luffy shed tears. Why isn't she afraid of Luo Lan? You soap rubbed his hair. I really want to hug Tilda. Sanji thumped the floor. Asshole Luo Lan. What kind of ecstasy soup did he pour into Little Millie? Hey Tilda, Leo Lan raised his eyebrows at the three of them, and took Little Millie from Nami with a smile. Daddy. Hug. Daddy hug. Little Millie hugged Leo Lan's neck happily. Her little head kept arching against him. She even patted her stomach, hungry. Ah ha Tilda. Everyone laughed heartily at the cute appearance of Little Mary. Good. Mary is hungry, so we bought the best dim sum. Leo Lan said softly and dotingly. And then Xiling communicated with the system space. Wow, the gigantic treasure tree Adam appeared in the open space next to it with a bang. Even if it is placed vertically, this piece of wooden Juan is as wide as a city wall. The moment he saw treasure tree Adam, little Millie suddenly showed a cute look, shaking his head and staring at treasure tree Adam. Eat dot 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 Millie Millie dot 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 to eat. Liu Olan came to Adam Mujuan with Xiao Mili in his arms, and also wanted to know how the benefits would be eaten Tilda. Everyone else stared curiously. Ah Wu Tilda. Melly opened his mouth and just took a bite. Seeing the incomparably strong Adam Wood, Kyo opened a whole Tilda. FK. Everyone exclaimed in unison. This mouth. Better than Luffy. And, little Millie's expression of enjoyment made it impossible to tell that she was eating wood at all. Especially the silky smoothness of her mouth. It's as silky as eating cream puffs Tilda. Ah Tilda, you soap couldn't hold back, and took a bite as well. Crack. The sonorous sound directly turned you soap's eyes white Tilda. Frankie laughed and explained, ha ha ha. This is the precious tree Adam. Even the best steel is not as strong as it. Ah Tilda, there is also an unbeliever. Luffy took a bite and, like you soap, rolled all over the floor with his teeth Tilda. Seeing that Xiaomili was eating deliciously, Liu Lan opened Xiaomili's attributes to meat. Um? Question mark. FK. What value is soaring? Question mark. Liu Olan quickly rubbed his eyes and looked over carefully. Good guy Tilda. Colon plus one comma plus one comma plus one comma plus one plus one plus one plus one plus one. On Xiaomili's attribute panel, there are two more attribute values. At this time, and these two attribute values. A crazy plus one, plus one soaring crazily. Chapter 155 Little Melly wants to read comics. Please subscribe. Hey, 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 hey. It seems like something has changed on the Mary. Flack lay on the deck of the Mary, shouting in shock while beating. What's wrong? Usopp was the first to approach. Later, Luffy, Chopper, and Sanji also rushed over. Listen to the deck like Frankie. Frankie's eyes widened. It's amazing. What happened? Seeing Frankie's appearance, everyone felt uneasy Tilda. It's amazing. Frankie said excitedly. Tell us. What happened to the Mary? Usopp looked up at Frankie eagerly. Everyone listen to me Tilda. Frankie looked at the impatient guys in front of him and announced excitedly. This is really amazing. Ah, arsehole. Everyone couldn't bear it anymore, and immediately they punched and kicked Tilda. Millie, the material of Millie has actually changed. Although it still has the composition of sorbet wood, it is definitely a huge change from the previous sorbet wood. After being beaten up, Frankie can speak easily Tilda. When everyone saw this, they went up and beat and kicked again. Frankie spoke more fluently, I guess. If little Melly can eat up the whole piece of Adam's wood, I'm afraid that Melly's material will be completely transformed into the material of the treasure tree. Wow, this is really great. In this way, does the Merry have the qualifications to continue to shuttle through the wind and waves? Luffy clenched his fists and looked at Frankie expectantly. Frankie replied with certainty, that's right. If it is completely transformed into the material of the treasure tree Adam, I'm sure that no matter how big the storm is, it will never be able to destroy the Merry. Wow, you soap. Sanji and Chopper hugged each other. Hey, 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 you should first think about when Adam and Little Millie will finish eating such a huge treasure tree Tilda calmly, Suo pointed to the towering giant tree. Everyone looked back. Compared with that towering giant tree, 
Little Millie's small mouth eats it bite by bite. I really don't know if I will eat it until the year of the monkey tilde. It's okay, we'll just wait here for her to finish eating. We can wait as long as we want. Luffy says what comes to mind, never just thinking about it. Nami rolled his eyes upwards. Sanji took a puff of a cigarette, and then said, I think I can take advantage of this time to go back to East Blue first. Go to the restaurant to earn a year's expenses, and bring it back as everyone's food expenses. Usopp nodded, well... Kaya and I can also go back to Sir Rob Village to see everyone Tilda and live for a year or so before coming back. Boom, boom. Luffy's two rubber fists landed on Sanji and Usopp's faces. Whoa. You two bastards. Think I can't hear your F king me? Nanny. Everyone was stunned Tilda, looking at Luffy in shock. This guy. Can actually tell that someone is burying him? F K Tilda. I've made progress. I seem to have a good idea Tilda. At this time, Nami's eyes suddenly brightened, and he spoke with a smile. Of course. Liu Olan could also think of the method she thought of. It's just that Liu Olan is looking at little Melly's attribute panel at this time, so his attention is not on the big guy. Hearing this, Sanji opened his eyes immediately. Ah, I thought of it too. Nami Chan must be using the method on Laboon, right? Yes, it's the method used on Laboon. Nami nodded brightly. When he left Cape Twins, Liu Olan decided to bring Laboon with him because he had the small card of crow. Laboon is currently living in the fish tank in the conference hall of Going Merry Tilda. When the weather is calm, Everyone will put it in a seat to have fun. Under normal circumstances, just rely on the ability of the small card to keep it in the fish tank. Liu Olan also deliberately found many beautiful little goldfish to put in the fish tank. Now Laboon is being chased by a large number of little goldfish sisters every day, and his mood gradually improves. Liu Olan's small card is now maintaining Laboon's body shape, so it's up to me to help Xiaomili. Talking, Nami won. A small card appeared in her hand. The spirit communicated the magic power of the cloud card and the small card instantly acted on the treasure tree Adam. Wow Tilda. Just like a great transformation into a living person, the towering giant screen disappeared in an instant. But if you look carefully, you will see a small wooden stick in Nami's hand. It's like the wooden stick biscuits sold in Blue Star Supermarket. <laughs> Bite the air. Little Mary cried again. Ahaha Tilda. Seeing the pitiful appearance of Little Millie with her upper and lower teeth biting together, everyone immediately laughed. Xiaomili doesn't cry Tilda. Come on, open your mouth Tilda. Nami took the small stick and brought it to Melly's mouth. Ah Tilda. Little Melly bites off half of Adam's trunk Tilda. Liu Olan, who was looking at Xiaomili's data at this time, was shocked. FK, FK truff 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 truff. On the attribute panel. Melly's durability and armor exploded in a blowout. Plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100. In addition, there are two more attributes, which are also soaring crazily. Capacity colon plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100. Expansion point. Plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 exclamation mark plus 100 dodge. 5%. What's the situation? Liu Olan turned off Xiaomili's property interface with a dazed expression. I rely. Looking at the small wooden stick that Nami held in his hand, Liu Olan immediately guessed that it was the trunk of the precious tree Adam. In fact, he had thought of making the treasure tree Adam smaller with a small card before. But Liu Olan was more cautious in thinking about the problem, worried that little Mili would not be able to bear the whole treasure tree Adam swallowed at once. So I plan to let Xiao Mili eat it one bite at a time, and then gradually increase it. Unexpectedly, in a flash, little Mili killed half of the tree trunk in one bite. A Hilda exclamation mark Tilda. At the moment when Liu Olan was in a daze, little Mili took another gulp. Good guy Tilda. The remaining half of the treasure tree Adam is gone. Hello. Liu Olan was in a hurry. Don't rush to swallow. Hold on carefully. Hearing Liu Olan's words, Nami also realized that she was a little reckless. Yes, although Bozu Adam has become smaller, it will not change. If such a large capacity is consumed all at once, what if Xiao Mili dies? Nami's eyes turned red immediately, and he went blank. Yes. Dot 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 dot. I'm sorry. Dot dot dot. I dot dot dot. I zero. Ask for flowers. But next moment Tilda, Belch exclamation mark underscore, a full Belch came out of Xio Millie's mouth Tilda, ah ha ha, everyone was amused, you, Nami's eyes were red, and she hugged Melly all of a sudden, her head full of guilt, fortunately, Mli is fine, otherwise she would definitely blame herself to death, ah Tilda, probably full, little Melly yawned with her mouth open Tilda, then fell asleep on Liu Olan's shoulder, Liu Olan, is little Mili okay, Nay looked at little Mili with some concern, it should just fall asleep, don't worry, 
I don't mean to blame you. Gently patted Nami's head, Liu Olan relieved. He checked Meli's property interface, durability, armor, carrying capacity, and expansion points have increased dramatically again. In addition, there is another attribute value, growth point, growth point, plus 10 exclamation mark plus 10 exclamation mark plus 10 exclamation mark plus 10. Although the growth point is also soaring, compared to the other several attribute values, the growth rate of the growth point is limited. Attributes such as durability and armor are fixed attributes at first glance. 0.0. However, expansion points, transformation points, and growth points are more likely to be expendable. I don't know how these are used tilde. However, little Millie is in a sleep state right now. Let's wait and study again tilde. After thinking for a while, Liu Olan then looked at Nami. I'll take little Mili to rest first. I'll leave the matter of setting sail to you. Well, don't worry. I will grasp the course. Seeing that Liu Olan didn't mean to blame her, Nami's mood improved a lot. Luffy shouted excitedly, Wow, take Meli and set off together. Usopp followed suit and yelled, Go. Back in the studio, Liu Olan's task for today has not been completed yet. But seeing that little Meli was sleeping soundly on his shoulder, he didn't put her down, just hugged her and continued to draw. Wait until the evening tilde. Aha tilde, with a long little yawn, cutie Mary woke up. Huh? Mary? Are you awake? Liu Olan temporarily put down the paintbrush in his hand, unconsciously, his face was filled with the love of an old father. Full and full, I patted my stomach, Melly's movements are very funny tilde, ah ha ha. Liu Olan laughed happily. Book dot 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 book. The little head turned to see the bookshelf next to it, and Mli pointed to the bookshelf. Oh? You even know books? Liu Olan is a little different. But I thought to myself, Mary is a ship elf born on the Golden Mary, it seems normal to know the book tilde. Mli jumped off Liu Olan and then jumped to the bookshelf. She turned her head to look at Liu Olan, and pointed to the comic book with her finger, the book. Read. Read. Ahaha Tilda. Mali's appearance is so cute, he smiled, you can read whatever you want, this entire bookshelf is yours Tilda. Little Mealy was stunned for a moment, then seemed to understand, and plunged into the pile of books. Liu Olan looked at it for a while, then picked up the brush again. He wants to hurry up and finish today's comic tasks, and then make time to bring the baby. Chapter 156 Ace. That's my brother! Exclamation mark please subscribe! Time flies, and it is evening. Liu Olan finally finished today's task. He turned his head to look over, and saw little Li was sitting over there holding a comic book, reading exactly the same tilde. It's so cute! Liu Olan smiled, and didn't think that little Mili could really understand anything, let alone that Mili would learn abilities from comics like other crew members. You know, Mili's current IQ is probably equivalent to that of a baby learning to speak, who doesn't know a single word, and still wants a degree. Do not joke. Opening Xio Millie's attribute interface, Liu Olan intends to study the three attributes of expansion point, transformation point and growth point. Question mark Mary, durable, 23.77 million, armor, 22.98 million, dodge, 5%, expansion points, 17.66 million, transformation points, 18.2 million, growth point, 1.32 million, um, Liu Olan frowned, as if something was wrong. This growth point, why is it missing? Question mark. Liu Olan remembered that when Little Mili was sleeping. He took a look at Little Mili's attribute points. At that time, Little Mili's attribute points had already stabilized. The other values are the same as 750 now, but the growth point at that time should be 1.45 million. But now it becomes 1.32 million. In such a short time, 130,000 growth points were lost. Where did it go? Question mark. Damn it. As soon as I finished talking here. Liu Olan discovered the problem, because the growth point is 1.32 million at this time, all the values in the tens of thousands have been shrunk. Liu Olan subconsciously clicked on it just now, but saw that the growth points were being consumed rapidly. 132,757,538 growth point is being consumed crazily at a rate of at least 5 points per second. FK me tilde what's going on? Liu Olan was a little confused. He looked at Xiao Mili. I secretly wondered, is it related to Xiao Mili reading comics? Immediately, he stood up gently, and tiptoed to the back of Little Mili, and glanced at the content of Little Mili's comics. Ship girl, good guy. It's actually a ship girl. But, there seems to be nothing wrong Tilda. Liu Lan remembers that when he was young, all the girls in his class liked to watch Sailor Moon Tilda. As a ship elf, Nami Xiao Mai likes to watch the ship girl. Well, there is nothing wrong with it. Mili? Do you like watching this Tilda? Liu Olan squatted down and asked softly. If you like it, then I will draw all the ship girls in this series for you. Little Mealy nodded. Well, it's so cute. Dot 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 Mealy, I like watching it. It's fine if you like it, if you like it, I. 
Hey, Leo Lan was just about to say that I like it, so I will draw more for you, but in the middle of the conversation, he suddenly choked up. Mally's speaking ability has obviously improved a lot compared to before. Before, I was jumping out syllable by syllable, and I couldn't even say words. But now, not only can she speak the words, but she can even roughly express the consciousness she wants to express. This obviously seems to be a feeling of growing up. It's beautiful, Lee still wants to see it. After finishing a manga, Mili turned around and pulled Liu Olan, even swaying Liu Olan's arm casually. But when she turned her head, Liu Olan froze immediately, because little Meli's face seems to have changed too. Obviously longer than before. Before, it could only be regarded as a child who was a little bigger than a baby. But now it looks more and more like a little Lili. It turns out that growth points are consumed like this. Liu Olan suddenly figured it out. Growth points, growth points, of course, are used to grow little Meli. It's just... Xiaomili's growth seems to be related to reading this comic. Since Mary likes to watch it, and can grow up after watching it, then it's good enough to watch it. Liu Olan immediately searched the bookshelves, and took down all the dozen or so comics about Jian Liang, and put them in a compartment on the bottom floor. Here, here are all the things you like to see. After patting the stack of comic books, Liu Olan pampered little Millie's face. There is more. Next, I will draw one for you every day. Little Millie smiled happily. Father dot 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 that's great. Puff exclamation mark. Liu Olan is an old draft tilde. I'm afraid I won't be able to take off the title of old father. Just when going Mary left the capital of Seven Waters, in a place called Benaro Island, a group of people from Blackbeard were eating here. Admiral, I have some big news for you. Laffitt came in from the door of the bar, holding a newspaper in his hand and slapping it on the table. Thief ha 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 ha, is there a certain pirate offering a reward of over 100 million? If so, then we can stop by and arrest him. Blackbeard teach grins picking up the newspaper from the table, with just one glance. He was taken aback, then, thief ha 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 ha, Blackbeard teach smiled happier than flowers. A reward of 420 million baileys is offered. This straw hat boy has really helped me a lot, as long as he is captured, then my shikai bukai position will definitely be stable. In his heart, there is a big plan that has been planned. That is to use the seven warlords of the sea as a springboard to realize his heinous plan of robbing the deep sea prison. Teach. This is 420 million bell. Don't underestimate him. Fanoka reminded with a sniper on his shoulder. Blackbeard Teach smiled and shook his head. Don't worry, he's just a rubber fruit capable user. As long as he meets me, no matter how powerful his rubber fruit is, he won't be able to use it. 17. Then he looked at the reason for the reward below, and suddenly showed a look of astonishment. Nanny? He smashed the Anai's lobby. He even killed the chief of CP9. This straw hat kid really can't see it. Dot dot dot. Is he so brave? Faced with this kind of thing. Even Blackbeard Teach thinks it can't do that crazy level. At this moment, he felt admiration for Luffy for the first time. The people around that kid are not easygoing. Moreover, their fate is very strange. At this time, the poisonous Q who was slumped on the table said in a very serious tone. If it is possible, Teach, I still I suggest you change your target. Thieves ha 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 ha. Now that they are confirmed to be them, there is no need to change them. Let's go, let's go out and find out their clues now. Laughing wildly a few times, Teach stood up stuffed a bottle of rum into his trousers, then picked up the packed Segura peach pie, and walked out carelessly. Fate, Poison Q wailed, was helped up by Burgess, and followed him out. I always feel that the straw hat boys are not easy Tilda Fanuka said looking at Laffitt. I feel the same way. I hope Teach won't run into those people Tilda. Shaking his head slightly, Laffitt loosened his shoulders and followed. On the street, Teach walked swaggeringly. Suddenly, a voice came from the roof. Teach, Finally found you. The five members of the Blackbeard Pirates looked up and saw one sitting on the roof. It is the captain of the Whitebeard Pirates second round Firefist Ace. Hey? Ace dot 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 captain. Seeing Ace, Blackbeard Teach had a look of joy on his face. Ace sneered, let's get rid of the captain. This title is used by people who know how to respect. Teach, don't treat me like an idiot. Yo. It's that Firefist Ace. Laffitt whirled the crutch in his hand, and said with a smile, not paying attention to Ace at all. But Ace responded very politely, yes. I'm the next one, please give me your advice, thief ha 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 ha, ace, long time no see, as if talking to an old friend, Blackbeard Teach seemed very cordial, of course, when you wake up, he and ace are indeed old friends, he also cheekily asked, what happened, how do you know I'm here, stop talking nonsense, Captain Marshall D Teach of the Blackbeard Pirates, what have you done, you know better than anyone else, ace crossed his fingers and snapped his fingers, obviously this is a habitual action before the battle, oh, I see, but let me say a word, seeing ace's posture, Blackbeard didn't pretend to be stupid anymore, he shouted with a serious face, Ace, you can join us too, I have made a careful plan, let's conquer the world together, Whitebeard Zero will end soon, and I will be the new One Piece, Blackbeard looked determined, and continued, the first step is, 
Heal the straw hat Luffy in the capital of the Seven Waters ahead, and hand him over to the world government. What? Luffy, hearing this, Ace frowned. Huh? Do you know him? Seeing Ace's appearance, Blackbeard Teach was also taken aback. You are so presumptuous. Ace's face suddenly looked like Shimatsuki's in the twelfth lunar month. His eyes were cold. He stared down at Blackbeard Teach, and said coldly, That's my brother. Chapter 157 Seal Fruit Ability Then. The roar of the fire dragon. Please subscribe. That's my brother. Looking down at the five members of the Blackbeard Pirates, Ace grinned slightly. Besides, it is of course impossible for me to join you. Wish wish. Dot. A series of bullets passed through Ace's body in an instant. But dot 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 it's useless for Ace who can enter the elemental state at any time tilde. The bullet passed through Ace's body, causing ripples of flame tilde. It seems dot 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 some people don't seem to be polite. While speaking, Ace looked down at Fanukar who shot the bullet just now. Hey hey. Seeing that his sneak attack had no effect, Fanukar smiled a little embarrassedly. But at this moment, a series of flaming bullets burst out from between Ace's fingers and shot toward Fanukar. Damn. His ability is really convenient. Fanukar's expression changed. Quang quickly moved sideways to dodge. Puff puff puff. The flame bullets seemed to be plowing the ground, chasing Fanukar's dodging trajectory, plowing the ground into two thick ravines. Ha. There was a roar from the nearby roof as boxing champion Badgers uprooted the house next door and threw it at Ace. This kind of trick is useless to me Tilda. O8 murmured disdainfully in Ace's mouth, and then raging flames erupted from his body. He drew a circle in front of him with both hands, flame ring fire pillar, boom. A pillar of flame, like a high pressure water gun, erupted from Ace's body Tilda. The moment the pillar of fire hit the house, it immediately blasted the huge house into pieces and scattered them from the sky. Damn. Badgers, Okar. Who told you to do it without authorization? You are not his opponent yet. Seeing this scene, Blackbeard Teach angrily yelled at his subordinates, quickly back off. Ah, sorry. Badgers hurriedly apologized, cold sweat breaking out on his forehead. The pillar of fire just now really made him feel frightened. Although Vanokar didn't say anything, he also understood at this moment that what Blackbeard said was right. Fire Fist. W. With Ace's low voice, the terrifying flames fell, setting off a shocking explosion. R exclamation mark. Under this shock wave, the Blackbeard pirates were immediately thrown into disarray tilde. Wow, it's so hot. Blackbeard screamed in pain. Among the five, he was the one who screamed the worst. But this is also impossible. Although the dark fruit is awesome, the ability user who ate this devil fruit feels pain twice as much as ordinary people. Captain. Captain. Seeing Blackbeard screaming like a pig being slaughtered, the other four were all nervous. Shut up. Get off everyone. Blackbeard roared then got up, he wiped the scorching air on his face, looked at Ace with a ferocious smile, ha ha ha, thief, Ace, I know you are here to kill me, but it's no wonder, killing your companion but what about the big sin, he patted the dust on his body, and then said, it is true that I killed Saki, the captain of the fourth team, but, there is no way, that guy got it the devil fruit I dreamed of, according to the rules on the ship, whoever finds it can eat it, hearing this, Ace's face was cold, so, you killed Sergeant took the devil fruit? It was due to the situation, Ace. Actually, this devil fruit chose me. Blackbeard grimaced, and he yelled, Thieves ha ha ha, I became the strongest, Ace. Your body is fire dot 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 and I, darkness. While speaking, Blackbeard Teach opened his arms wide open, making a look of looking up to the sky tilde. Boom, billows of black hair rose from his body to the sky. Ace, let me show you the power of this devil fruit right now. The darkness swarmed out of Blackbeard Teach like a tidal wave spreading crazily towards the surrounding towns. In the blink of an eye, the entire town was completely surrounded by darkness. Wow. Is there something crawling on the ground? It came out of that guy. It feels like I'm going to be sucked in. It's so scary. Don't touch it. Run away. The people in the town suddenly fled in panic. The so-called darkness is followed by gravity. A power that can attract everything. Even light cannot escape. That's infinite gravity. Thief ha ha ha. The more Blackbeard Teach spoke, the more excited he became. The luster on his face became extremely ferocious. It's really boring Tilda. Ace shook his head slightly, then stretched out his palm. Firefly fired armor. Like a firefly. The small luminous light cluster fluttered towards Blackbeard's Teach. The next moment, Teach was on fire. Wow. It's so hot. It's burning me to death. Blackbeard rolled over again. Seeing this scene, Ace frowned. Since you are a Logia capable user, you should be able to easily avoid this trick. After screaming, Blackbeard's face was sullen. I'm different from you. I can't elementalize, and my pain perception is doubled. But as compensation, I can attract something. As he said that, he was full of black hair. K. His palm seemed to produce a dark Uzumaki, bursting out of violent attraction. Dot. Ace didn't have time to react at all. His whole body seemed to be shoved violently by a hundred big guys, and he flew towards Blackbeard in a whoosh. With a big hand, Blackbeard grabbed the shoulder of Ace who was flying over. He grinned loudly. Thief ha ha ha. 
the gravitational force of darkness can accurately attract the body of the capable person. As long as I see the capable person, I can't run away even if I want to! Exclamation mark. My body. Ace's expression changed drastically. He felt the power of Mera Mera fruit in his body suddenly disappear. This feeling is like wearing sea stone handcuffs, and it is impossible to use the power of devil fruit at all. How? Huh? You should have found out, Ace. Blackbeard Teach looked arrogant. He stared into Ace's eyes, and suddenly raised his mouth. Boom. He punched out violently, and the force of the explosion hit Ace's body solidly. Ace's body suddenly changed from marching back to curling up like a crayfish, and hit the ground faster than a cannonball. Boom. With such a powerful force. The ground exploded directly. Thief ha 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 ha. As a Logia capable user, you haven't been hit by someone for a long time, right? As if the winning ticket was in his hands, Blackbeard Teach crossed his arms in front of him. The moment you are caught by me, I believe you will understand that the only thing my dark power can attract is the devil power. That is to say, as long as the body is touched by me, the ability user will not be able to use any ability. Hearing this, Ace was thoughtful, and then he sighed with emotion. Is that so? Then, Thanks to him Tilda. What are you talking about? Hearing such an irrelevant sentence from Ace, Blackbeard teaches mood almost split. He snorted coldly, whether it's Logia, Paramecia or Zone, they are all overconfident in their abilities. However, for all the 330 abilities in this world, I, Teach, have the ability to make them defenseless. Thief ha ha ha. Don't dream there, Teach. In this world, there is absolutely no way for a certain devil fruit to dominate. At least, I know that there is a devil fruit whose ability will not be restricted by your dark fruit. The moment he was caught by Blackbeard's sister-in-law just now, Ace could feel his Mera Mera fruit ability disappear. 8. The ability from the creation of the fruit of the manga has not been deselected. This gave him confidence immediately. He wiped the stain from the corner of his mouth, and looked at Blackbeard. Besides, as long as I don't get caught by you, can't it be fine? Thieves ha ha ha. You are indeed beautiful, but... Under the gravity of darkness, you cannot escape. K. Blackbeard Teach activates the fruit ability again. Cool. There was a sound of breaking wind, and Ace's body flew towards Blackbeard uncontrollably. The speed was so fast that Ace was caught by Blackbeard in an instant. Thief ha ha ha. Give me another punch. Blackbeard had the chance to win, and he was not in a hurry to knock down Ace all at once, but slowly raised his fist, aiming at Ace's face and blasting it out. But at this moment, a sneer appeared on Ace's face. The next moment, Ace suddenly raised his head and took a deep breath tilde. The roar of the fire dragon. Billowing flames erupted from Ace's mouth. The originally dark sky was suddenly illuminated extremely brightly. Rumble tilde. The temperature of the entire atmosphere is also instantly ignited at this moment. Chapter 158 Absorb Darkness, Dark Flame Dragon Mode Please subscribe. Teacher's fruit ability is really pervert. As the captain of the second division of the Whitebeard Pirates, Ace is a guy who scares many people, but now he can only be at the mercy of Teach. That's right. As long as a capable person stands in front of Teach, it seems that they can only wait till the ha ha ha. Look, Ace got caught by Teach again. He's done. The four people standing nearby watching the battle were talking and laughing at this moment. But just when they thought they had the chance to win, Rumble Tilda, the flames of the dragon burst out from Ace's mouth. The dazzling light instantly blinded their dog eyes Tilda. The terrible flames engulfed Blackbeard Teach in an instant. Nanny. Dash. Unbelievable horror burst out on the faces of the four of them at the same time. Laffit opened his mouth wide and exclaimed, Hey, hey. Wasn't he caught by Teach? Why can he still use the ability of Mera Mera Fruit? Badgers also had question marks all over his head. Can't Teach's dark fruit absorb the ability of Mera Mera Fruit? No. Judging from Ace's reaction before, the ability of his Mera Mera Fruit has indeed been sealed. Fanokar shook his head, and he continued to analyze. If I heard correctly, just now Ace seemed to say that he knows that there is a devil fruit ability that will not be restricted by dark fruit. Is he relying on that devil fruit ability? Ahem. What are you talking about? One person can't eat two devil fruits at the same time. Poison Q reminded with a dying look. Isn't Teach the captain of our Blackbeard pirates? Fanukar spread his hands, and finally shook his head. But I didn't mean to say that A set two devil fruits. Couldn't he use the history of other devil fruits in the form of? What form? Badgers scratched his head. Fanukar pouted. How would I know? Ah. Dash. On the other side, Blackbeard's screams were directly earth-shattering. He covered his face and rolled all over the floor unable to extinguish the fire dragon flames on his body for a while. It wasn't until he rolled more than a dozen times that the flame on his face was barely extinguished. Oh, you are still alive, you are indeed a dark fruit capable user, your face is really dark Tilda. Ace couldn't help joking as he watched Blackbeard burn into a cure me like face. Arsehole. Blackbeard patted his left cheek, where the burn was the heaviest just now. The drama is incomparable. He is very sure that there will be a scar on the left side of his face. Originally, I wanted to persuade you to join the team because I was a partner of the same team. Now, Ace, you personally ruined this possibility. Teach lowered his head slightly, his eyes were full of resentment. Oh Tilda, 
It looks like you have a serious burn on the left side of your face. It should be a scar. Ace noticed the injury on Teach's left face, and then realized why Teach suddenly became so resentful. But he smiled sassily. However, you are already dying, so there is no need to care about leaving scars on your face. Don't be too arrogant, Ace. What happened to your flame just now? It seems that it is not the same fire as your Mera Mera Fruits flame. As a man who was burned by Mera Mera Fruit and Dragon Slayer Magic Flames at the same time in less than a few minutes, Blackbeard Teach could clearly feel the difference between the two flames. If I have to say, this flame is also produced by Devil Fruit, but it is someone else's Devil Fruit. The corners of Ace's mouth raised slightly, so, Dad is right, you are indeed too big. Teach, we are here to help you. You are responsible for sealing his Mera Mera Fruit's ability and preventing him from entering elementalization. We are responsible for the output. I have already seen that although its other flame is not blocked by Dark Fruit, it cannot make him enter elementalization. Yeah, let's deal with him together. The other four members of the Blackbeard Pirates realized that the situation was wrong and they were about to intervene immediately, but Ace laughed contemptuously. You little characters, stop being self-righteous. As he said that, Ace's right arm spurted out a large piece of flame. Mirror flame. Underscore. These flames instantly formed a flame barrier in front of the other four members of the Blackbeard Pirates, blocking the four of them on the other side of the flame. Teach, this is an internal matter of our second team, I don't want others to interfere. Ace held his right fist in his left hand, making a crackling sound. Thieves ha 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 ha. I didn't mean to ask them to take action. Blackbeard's smile turns cruel tilde. A large amount of dark matter surged out from his body, and it grows when it sees the wind. It quickly formed a scale that covered the sky and the sun. Blackbeard raised one hand to the sky, and those dark matter seemed like fish that found a hole, frantically condensing toward a dark ball held in Blackbeard's hand. Ace, you forced me to do this. I won't hold back anymore. If you die from this blow, it will be bad luck for you. While speaking, the black ball formed by the silent and dark matter has been growing continuously. Behind it, the billowing dark matter is like a thick fog, making Blackbeard teach a dark world behind him. I can't see anything at all Tilda. Ace watched quietly, he looked at the boundless darkness, and at Teach's blackened appearance at this time. Teach, it seems that this devil fruit really matches you. People with dark hearts. Coupled with the fruit that brings darkness to the world. What a gang. Even if you say that, I won't let you go. Teach's icy opening. At this time, the dark matter ball in his hand seemed to condense to a critical point, and began to tremble violently. Haven't responded yet, Ace, you are so careless. However, even if you use the power of flames, it's useless. This black hole of darkness can absorb all your flames. As he said that, he swung his raised arm in the direction of Ace. The dark matter ball seemed to be thrown out fiercely, and flew towards Ace with a whoosh. The boundless darkness rushed towards Ace together. Hiss, the flame barrier in front of the other four members of the Blackbeard Pirate group just disappeared at this moment and they immediately saw this terrible scene. The world before their eyes is divided into two by darkness. On one side is bright sunny sky, on the other side is eternal darkness. At this time, under the leadership of the dark matter ball, the dark world is like a monster that can devour everything, and it is fiercely opening its mouth towards Liu Olan and biting it. It's terrible. Even standing at such a far distance, you can still feel the despair brought by this darkness. I have never seen Teach use this ability before. It seems that he is really angry this time. It's not just about anger, but more importantly, Ace's strength is too strong. Yeah, especially that Huo Pao Xiao, who is not restricted by dark fruit, it's too stupid. A if you want to say shameless, our captain's body is even more shameless Tilda. At the intersection of the four of them's eyes, the dark world led by the dark matter ball crashed into Ace. Die. Looking at Ace indifferently, Blackbeard Teach is already waiting to collect Ace's body. Anyway, he just needs to exchange the head of the big man among pirates for the position of seven warlords of the sea, dead or alive are the same Tilda. Too. When the darkness fell in front of Ace, he opened his mouth directly. Question mark. The Blackbeard Teach recruit frowned his head full of question marks. Why are you opening your mouth? Do you still want to eat? As soon as this idea crossed his mind, Blackbeard Teach's mouth suddenly opened wide. Ah! Dash. Blackbeard's eyes widened fiercely, his shocked mouth split open to the back of his head. Nima, I'm just talking nonsense about opening my mouth to eat Tilda. You are actually eating it. But the problem is, that is the dark matter produced by my fruit ability. How is this possible to eat? Question mark. To be precise, it should, be well, suck. Hulalu Tilda, and race his big mouth full. The dark substance that seemed to cover the sky and the sun, like seawater meeting Yuzu you, Maki, entered Ace's mouth ferociously. Suck slip Tilda. When all the dark matter was sucked in by Ace, Ace wiped the corner of his mouth on Madara's face with obvious tits. A smile appeared suddenly. Teach, I'm full. Nonsense. Why doesn't he the dark matter in such a large area support you to death? Teach thought with a dark heart. And at this time, Ace's body surface suddenly burst into billowing flames. Then, a large amount of black matter also emerged from Ace's body. What? 
That is my dark power. When they saw the black substance, everyone in Blackbeard Teach was dumbfounded tilde. What's the situation? Didn't he you agree that I'll drink Mera Mera fruit from dark fruit? How can he suck my dark fruit now with Mera Mera fruit? Question mark. Just when he couldn't figure it out, a roar broke out from Ace's mouth. Dark Flame Dragon Mode. Chapter 159 The Use of Transformation Points and Expansion Points. Please subscribe. The darkness wrapped in the raging flames tilde. The power of darkness blends with flames tilde. Became a new kind of flame. Exclamation mark. This seems outrageous. But this is one of the tricks of dragon flame magic. Absorb other material elements and merge with your own flame to form a new flame. Am I dazzled? What the hell? He actually absorbed Teach's dark power. How did Ace do it? It's not just absorbed, it's also turned into your own use. Damn it. Is this the strength of the second opposing captain of the Whitebeard Pirates? It's too scary. The other dead men of the Blackbeard Pirates were completely at a loss at this time. Although they didn't say it, they felt that Teach might not be able to pass today's test. While thinking wildly, Ace attacked. I saw him flying forward suddenly, with his arms open. Black flames were pulled out of the shape of dragon wings on his arms. Almost instantly, Ace was in front of Blackbeard Teach. Dark flame dragon apostrophe s dot 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 wing strike. Arms carrying dark flames slammed onto Teach's head. As soon as Teach's head buzzed, he felt the sky full of little stars. However, this is only the mildest symptom. When the dark flame fell on Blackbeard Teach, the fierce burning also contained the constant devouring of the dark power. Although Dark Fruit's ability will not harm the person with the ability, but the dark power absorbed by the dragon slaying magic will be baptized into elemental power with dragon attributes. It does not belong to the ability user of Dark Fruit. Obi, devour and burn double buff, plus Blackbeard's own pain double debuff. His screams can be described as unprecedented, but all this is not the end but just the beginning. When Ace hit Blackbeard's head hard with both hands, he grabbed the 727 and grabbed Blackbeard's head. Take a big breath. Taking advantage of the Dark Flame Dragon mode remaining for a while, he violently spewed out the Dark Flame. The roar of the Dark Flame Dragon. Rumble tilde. In the special X Yan Long mode, once the roar of X Yan Long is activated, this new type of Nenwang will be erupted in one go. At this moment, all the Dark Flames seem to be charging towards the enemy with thousands of horses, red-eyed, desperately attacking. Ace is in midair and the Dark Flame Dragon's roar is sprayed downwards with Teach downwards. In an instant, Dark Flames engulfed Teach. After a while, when the Dark Flame Dragon mode was released, Ace also felt a burst of embarrassment. I have to say that although this mode is cool, it consumes a lot of money. Look at Teach. At this time, his whole body was in tatters, as if he had been bitten by some wild beast. It was horrible. Those wounds still smell of darkness and flames tilde. On the ground behind him, the darkness directly hit a slanted pit. At a glance, I don't know how deep it is. Zed. It's pitch black inside. Boom. Teach lost consciousness and fell to the ground. Ah. Teach. Badgers, as the person who most supports Teach in the team, his mentality is about to explode. Rushing not far from Blackbeard, he stared at Ace. He. Is he dead? Don't worry. His life is in my hands. He went back and asked Dad to execute this bastard himself. Ace bent down slightly, reached out and grabbed the back of Blackbeard Teach's clothes, and then he was half cold. Badgers rushed to the front of Ace. Wait, he's our captain, we won't let you take him away. Ace curled his lips tilde, boom, the flame exploded, and Badgers was thrown out. I don't have time for you little people. After leaving a sentence coldly, Ace just dragged Teach away. What are you guys doing? Why didn't you save Teach just now? When Ace disappeared, Badgers slowly came to his senses. When he saw that Teach was gone, he was furious. Fanukar sneered, what are you kidding? You haven't seen Ace's strength. In that case, making a move would be tantamount to suicide let alone saving Teach. What do you mean? Are you planning to break up? Badgers looked furious. Laffit also reprimanded him. Come on, can you use your brain to do things? Since we can't beat him head on, let's follow him from a distance first. Let's see if there is any chance to save Teach from him. Poison Q. Ahem, it's like this. Time flies. A few days have passed tilde. Going merry. In the studio, little Millie sat on the floor and watched Jian Niang's comics. Liu Olan put down the paintbrush. Today's task is completed and another cartoon of the ship girl is released. Hut Hilda? When Liu Olan looked at Xiao Mili's back, it seemed that he had changed a bit from the morning tilde. Open the property interface of little Millie. Question mark Mary? Durable. 23.77 million. Armor? 22.98 million. Force? 130,000. Dodge? 5%. Expansion points? 17.66 million. Transformation points? 18.2 million. Growth point? 860,000. In just a few days of hard work, Nearly 500,000 growth points have been consumed. It's not Bailey's fault. Otherwise, seeing such a sharp drop in the value, it would be so heartbreaking. Question mark. Etc. Just as he was about to close Xio Millie's attribute interface, Liu Olan suddenly turned his attention to the bottom of the armor attribute. Power, 
130,000. What the hell? Little Melly has the firepower, but... Where is it? Liu Olan left the table and walked behind Melly. After Melly finished reading the comic, Liu Olan made a sound. Little Melly, have you changed today? Daddy hugs. Hearing Liu Olan's voice, Little Melly turned around, opened a pair of small hands and jumped straight at Liu Ogang. Okay. Hug. The Xiaomili's request, Liu Olan found that he was really helpless. Picking up Xiaomili, Liu Olan realized that this little Lili's brows were a little more delicate, and... The feeling of holding it in the hand is also much heavier. Liu Olan looked at Xiaomili's whole body tilde. Well no wonder it's heavy tilde. These two legs are obviously half a foot to a foot longer than yesterday. Little Meli. Do you have any special changes today? Holding Xiaomili in his arms. He walked to the side sofa and sat down. Liu Olan asked again. Yes. The little cutie pursed her mouth slightly, and her appearance was really lovable. Aided. What is it then? Liu Olan's voice also softened involuntarily. He he. It's this Tilda. Little Mealy stood on Liu Olan's lap, kicked her little foot, and made a backflip in the air. Careful. Although I have seen Little Mealy's backflip yesterday, Liu Olan was still terrified when he did it so suddenly Tilda. I was afraid that Little Mary would fall. However, after Little Melly tossed, she landed steadily on the ground. Mary, arm it. When the immature voice came, a gleam suddenly appeared on Little Mealy's body. The next moment, two shoulder armors shaped like machine guns appeared on both sides of her shoulders. Puff. Liu Olan spitting at the old trough Tilda. I am Nima. Ship girl? Although Xiaomili has been reading the comics of the ship girl, but Liu Olan never thought that she would evolve into a ship girl. After all, although the growth points have been continuously consumed these past few days, Little Millie is indeed growing. Liu Olan really didn't expect that he has evolved. It is estimated that there is a lot of credit for the growth point. It seems that we have to find a way to get some growth points for Little Marido. Now that Little Millie can grow up, Liu Olan must be the happiest. According to his guess, the growth point should be obtained by Little Millie's food. Once these food conditions must be very harsh, because in the past few days, Little Millie has been eating every day. She and everyone can see that she eats three meals a day normally. It's just that eating these things can only bring comfort and satiety to Little Millie's taste buds, but it doesn't cause any changes in attribute values. Since Spozu Adam can bring a lot of attribute values to Little Millie, then Yang Shuiv should be able to. Although Yang Shuiv is the source of the light source for the Fishmen Island, is it? It shouldn't be a problem if I quietly dig a piece of it Tilda. Liu Olan rubbed his chin thinking. For the sake of Mili, let's make a cameo appearance of Nami's former career Tilda. By the way, since Little Mary has firepower, it stands to reason that there should be corresponding changes on going Mary's ship. Thinking of this, Liu Olan took Little Mili to the deck. Hey, Little Mili. Usopp Uncle is here Tilda. On the watchtower, Usopp waved his hands excitedly. Liu Olan picked up Xiaomili and moved her feet Tilda. Shave. The next moment, he appeared next to Usopp with Little Mili. Hello Tilda. Usopp is making faces at Little Mili Tilda. But the little guy didn't seem to appreciate it, and buried his little head in Liu Olan's chest. From here, you can see all of the Golden Mary. Liu Olan looked at it for a while but didn't find any signs of increased firepower. What's the situation Tilda M? Thinking about it, Liu Olan opened Mili's property interface again. Huh? Could it be here? He noticed that there is an extra plus sign behind the expansion point and the transformation point. Without thinking too much, Liu Olan first clicked on the plus sign behind the expansion point. A new interface appears. Question mark going Mary can expand capacity by 10%. Will it consume 10 million expansion points to complete? Depend on. It turned out to be like this. Liu Lan immediately confirmed it. Um, Usopp suddenly exclaimed. He makes. He rubbed his eyes vigorously, and then grabbed Liu Lan's arm. Hey, hey, hey. Do you think the melee has gotten bigger? Um, dot 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 yes. It did get bigger. Liu Lan gave a dry laugh. I didn't expect this expansion to be so straightforward. Without any vigorous movement, it suddenly became bigger. Subsequently, the modification point was opened. Going Mary can add and change content. The port cannon. Does it cost 6 million modification points to complete? Question mark. Going Mary can add and change content. Starboard cannon. Does it cost 6 million modification points to complete? Question mark. Seeing the two modifiable items, Liu Olan almost understood. The items that can transform the hull are related to the ability that Little Mili has evolved. If there is no accident, it should be that the firepower configuration evolved by Xiaomili and the hull can be transformed. Without thinking too much, Liu Olan chose OK again. Ah. Underscore, Usopp, who was still in shock, suddenly screamed again. He widened his two eyeballs, and stared at the port and starboard cannons, which were about the same size as the main gun tilde. I rely on a machine gun as big as the main gun. Isn't this the main gun with a burst of fire? And there are two. I. 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 Am I falling asleep? Am I dreaming right now? Usopp scratched his face and couldn't believe what he was seeing. Well, 
Yes, I just came to your dream. You sleep for a while, and I will take little Mary back to the cabin first Tilda. Liu Olan smiled and left a sentence, and went back with little Mealy in his arms. Chapter 160 Kizaru, what is this pervert? Please subscribe. Time flies, a few days have passed Tilda. A small island near the Sabadi archipelago, here is a marine base. Thief ha ha ha. It's here. The big raft of the Blackbeard pirates slowly approached the port of marine base, and Teach the Blackbeard laughed. Beside him is the fire fist ace caught by him. Yes. Now it's him, grabs Ace. Originally, Teach thought he was going to be doomed in this wave, but what he never expected was. Ace gets seasick tilde. Although the symptoms of seasickness are not very serious, but in the state of seasickness, Ace cannot use the fire dragon magic. After recovering a bit, Blackbeard sees the opportunity to counter Ace. I can't use the fire dragon magic on the ship, and the ability of Mera Mera fruit is blocked by Blackbeard's dark fruit. In addition, Blackbeard Teach's physical skills are also quite powerful. As a result, Ace fell into the hands of Blackbeard Teach. Afterwards, Blackbeard Teach contacted Marine and wanted to hand over the big pirate who offered a reward of 550 million baileys to Marine. It's really the captain of the Whitebeard Pirates 2nd Division. On the port, Vice Admiral, the Flying Squirrel, looked at the young man caught by Blackbeard Teach, with surprise in his eyes. Afterwards, he said, the Marshal is waiting in the base, you give Ace to me now, and I will report to the Marshal. Hearing this, Blackbeard Teach was amazed. Oh, even Sengoku is here? Thieves ha ha ha. Is it such an exaggeration? Stop talking nonsense. We don't have nothing to do with it for the time being. Let's hand over people first. Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral said coldly. It's not that I don't pay, but once he leaves the ship or leaves me, Ace will recover. At that time, this is not a period you can handle. Blackbeard Teach spread his hands, then grinned and said, Since Sengoku is here, I suggest you call out Sengoku and let him receive it. Blackbeard. Don't forget. This is Marine Base. If you are told to make friends, do so. Don't talk so much nonsense. With a backer behind you, you have the confidence to speak. Vice Admiral, the Flying Squirrel, stared at Blackbeard coldly, his tone almost full of command. Captain, why don't you give it to him Tilda? Lafitte stood at the top of the raft, his cane twirled in his hand. Ha ha ha, give it to him. Badgers raised his arms high and laughed. How could Blackbeard not know what the two of them were thinking? But since this Vice Admiral is so attractive, then give it. Blackbeard reminded. Then I will put my ugly words in front of you. Ace will leave it to you, and everything that happened is not my responsibility. Whoosh! Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral threw a sea stone handcuff and said, Use this to handcuff him, and you won't be responsible for anything. Teach glanced at Badgers beside him. Badgers picked up the sea stone handcuffs and handcuffed Ace. Then, as soon as Teach tried hard, he threw Ace over. I got you, Captain of the Whitebeard Pirates second team, Firefist Ace. Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral caught Ace, held him down with his backhand and said in a cold voice, I'll see you later. I'm afraid I can't do what you want. A smile formed on the corner of Ace's mouth. Leaving the boat, keep your feet on the ground. Ace's seasickness can be explained in seconds tilde. In this way, the flame dragon slayer magic was naturally awakened again. You big pirates, you really don't forget to pretend in any situation. You can't use your fruit power now, so you should die and want to escape. Listening to Ace's words, the flying squirrel vice admiral didn't care at all. There is even some disdain on the face. But the next moment, his face suddenly became shocked. I saw a raging flame ignited on Ace's body with a bang. Nanny, Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral has a heartfelt mention. Damn, Blackbeard cheating, wrong. Dot. The sea stone handcuffs were given by me. They will not be faked. But why is he still able to use the fruit ability when he is handcuffed by sea stone? Certainly, it's just that he didn't have time to think about it, so he went to draw the knife with a clang, the iron fist of the fire dragon. Underscore, Ace's flaming fist slammed into the blade of the Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral, boom. Dash, the power of terror as the Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral's arm jerks. What? What's going on with this power? Vice Admiral, the Flying Squirrel, originally thought that his knife would pass through the elementalization of Ace, but at the moment of the strike, he realized that he was wrong. Exclamation mark. His knife was slammed away, and then Ace's fire fist landed hard on his chest, boom, with an earth-shattering sound. The Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral was directly blasted on the wall of the nearby fortress, smashing a lot of masonry tilde. Thief ha ha ha. Seeing the miserable appearance of the Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral, Whitebeard is dying of laughter tilde. I told you everything and you didn't listen. It's all right now. Shoot. Cover Vice Admiral. Dot. The surrounding marine soldiers raised their guns one after another, and shot at Ace. Fire whip of the fire dragon. Ace's arm made a void sweep in the direction of the marine soldiers tilde. Boom tilde. The billowing flames and scorching air waves overturned all these marine soldiers at once. Afterwards, Ace went to Vice Admiral, the flying squirrel, and took the key of the sea stone handcuffs from his waist. Insert, 
Rotate, boom, the sea stone handcuffs fell to the ground, thief ha 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 ha, congratulations, ace, you are free, Teach stood on the big raft and said jokingly, but this is marine base, as you heard just now, Sengoku is also here, so, you must not escape, then give it a try, as an outstanding representative of the new generation, although ace looks like a silly big brother in front of Luffy, in fact he is very unruly, what is the face of danger, unless you die in battle, you will never surrender, but the next moment, when three figures walked out of the building of the base, Ace's face suddenly changed. Arsal, why don't you put Seastone handcuffs on this guy? As soon as Sengoku came out, he saw Ace in an unrestrained state and was furious. He didn't come out by chance, but he was attracted by the roar of the flying squirrel Vice Admiral hitting the base building just now. Woo Tilda, Vice Admiral has been defeated Tilda, it's really scary Tilda. On Sengoku's left, Kizaru said with a strange expression, pursed his thick lips, and laughed. Zero seeking flowers. On the other side. Seikezuki looked gloomy, it's a disgrace to Marine to let the pirates make a fuss here. When these three people appeared, not only Ace was stupid Tilda, even Blackbeard is dumb. I'll be good Tilda. What's the situation? Isn't it just to receive the second captain of the Whitebeard pirates? As for dispatching a marshal and two admirals, those who didn't know thought you were here to pick up Whitebeard. Teach, is that what you call grab? At this time, behind Sengoku, another old man appeared. Impressively officially naval headquarters great staff vice admiral. Blackbeard doesn't know what to say anymore. A marshal, two admirals, and a marine chief of staff at this time. Good guy. You are welcoming your son-in-law. But since Grain vice admiral asked, Blackbeard teach immediately grinned and said, the thief ha ha ha. Don't get me wrong, I originally put Ace on the boat and waited for you to come. But that vice admiral insisted that I hand it over to him. I'll give it to you, and you should be able to guess what happened next, right? Forget it. Seikezuki, take the ace. Too lazy to listen to Blackbeard's explanation, Sengoku ordered angrily. Seikezuki has always acted swiftly and swiftly, and when he received Sengoku's order, he stepped on his feet immediately and appeared in front of Ace. He coldly ordered, You damn guy, get caught immediately. Don't make me bother. Do not make jokes. Ace sneered, making the shape of two pistols with both hands at the same time. Puff puff puff. Dot. The flaming bullets shot out immediately. However, when these bullets fell on Seikezuki's body, they just splashed some ripples, and they couldn't even penetrate, huh? Can't even break through elementalization? Ace is this brow, and it is the first time he has seen this kind of situation. Did you know? Fruits also have a restrained relationship. My lava lava fruit happens to be the top fruit of your merry merry fruit. Gently brushing off the flame ripples on his body, like dusting off dust, Seikezuki's right arm turned into billowing magma. Great eruption. The terrible high temperature directly burned the air to give off a scorched smell. The magma exploded in front of Ace in an instant and Seikezuki said disdainfully, don't die Tilda, otherwise it will affect Sengoku's plan. But at this moment, Ace opened his mouth. He actually sucked this great eruption into it suddenly. Nanny Tilda, Kizaru's eyes widened in astonishment, and he shouted, did you even swallow Seikezuki's magma? What kind of pervert is this Tilda? Um? Question mark. Sengoku frowned suddenly, and said in disbelief, how is this possible? Thief ha ha ha. Blackbeard teach laughed loudly, sure enough, not only the power of darkness can swallow me, but also the magma of Ake Ainu. Fan Okar complained strangely. This guy, he really catches whatever he eats Tilda. Chapter 161 Ace is finally captured. Please subscribe. Hello Tilda, you at my great eruption? Seikezuki's face is incredible, thinking that his eyes are blurred. He is very sure that lava lava fruit must be the top fruit of mera mera fruit. The temperature of the magma can burn the temperature of the flame. In Marine's database, there are many records of the successive users of Devil Fruit, as well as the battle situation. There is no doubt that the magma is rolling and burning. But what is the situation right now? A person who has burnt and is capable, but he is fine after eating my magma. Could it be that the records in the Marine database are wrong? Boom. At this moment, Ace's body suddenly burst out with more violent flame marks. What? This time, Seikezuki was even more shocked because he saw a lot of magma in the flames on Ace's body tilde. Rather than saying it is a flame, it is better to say that it is the fusion of magma and flame. Lava flame dragon mode. Ace's whole body vibrated, and then he held it with his right hand and blew it by his mouth tilde. The roar of the magma flame dragon. The overwhelming flames of magma exploded from Ace's mouth, instantly forming a pillar of magma that swallowed Seikezuki. Crane Vice Admiral's Ace suddenly condensed from 607. That flame, something is wrong. Kizaru curled his lips, if I'm not mistaken. The flame should be carrying Seikezuki's magma. Mera Mera fruit is the lower fruit of lava lava fruit. It is absolutely impossible to do this step. Sengoku's expression sank. Then he turned to look at Blackbeard Teach, and scolded. What the hell is going on? Thief ha 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 ha. Ace can not only use the ability of Mera Mera fruit. He can also use the ability of another kind of fruit. But as for what it is, 
Then I don't know Tilda. Blackbeard Teach didn't intend to hide anything, and immediately told all the information he knew. Another fruit ability. Hearing this, Sengoku, Jura Vice Admiral and Kizaru all opened their mouths in astonishment. What kind of outrageous thing is this? Rumble Tilda. The lava flame dragons roaring crossing. A large area of? The marine base has been burnt Tilda. And Seikezuki, who was hit head on was also braving scorched heat waves all over his body at this time. Arsal, using elementalization to quickly come out of this messy and dirty look, Seikezuki roared angrily. He has a burn on his face. He also has a scar tilde. Seeing this scene, Blackbeard Teach suddenly felt balanced tilde. Seikezuki, your face? Kizaru swished to the side of Seikezuki, looked at the burn scar on his face, and was completely confused. What's going on? Even if he can spray your lava back, but you are a magma man, why are you still will be burned by magma? Damn, his ability is weird. After my magma was swallowed by him, it fused with its flame to form a new energy, and its power even surpassed my magma. Seikezuki was about to explode. Today was originally to follow Marshal Sengoku to go through a cutscene. Unexpectedly, not only did Sengoku fail to do a small lord casually, but he was also injured. Even the scars on the face. Shame, it is simply a shame. Crimson dog tooth. Furious, Seikezuki strikes again. His arm melted into lava higher than before, forming a bulldog with fangs. The red dog, which was covered in boiling magma, pounced on Ace while biting. Thief ha ha ha. Still here? I really don't have a long memory tilde. Blackbeard Teach standing on the big raft laughed. As he expected, Ace opened his mouth and sucked the canine red lotus in. Next moment tilde. Crimson flame dragon mode. On Ace's body, the color of the fusion flame becomes even more colorful. The filial piety of the red lotus flame dragon. Ace doesn't use any fancy moves. Just this new one. Get out of the way. Kizaru kicked Seikezuki away, and he turned into a beam of light and retreated to the other side in an instant. He's a battle veteran. With the lessons learned from the driver who swiped the card just now, he would not be so foolish as to let such an attack fall on him. The moment Seikezuki was kicked away by Kizaru, he also used Marine Six Styles Shave to speed up his dodge. Red Lotus Flame Dragon's roar instantly hit the opposite base building. Boom, 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 boom. A series of breakdown sounds sounded tilde. When the roar of Red Lotus Flame Dragon came to an end, a series of walls in the building of Marine Base were directly penetrated. From here, you can directly see the hillside scenery behind the Marine Base. What an exaggeration tilde. One person can make such a big fuss. On the big raft, Laffitt was really amazed. Fano Carp outed. That's not. If he didn't just want to catch Teach, our Blackbeard pirate group might have been wiped out by him. At this time, Sengoku angrily yelled at Blackbeard, Teach, how did you catch him before? Seeing Ace's ability, Sengoku realized that brute force cannot be used. It is better to grasp the information first. Thief ha ha ha. Actually he caught me, and then he wanted to escort me to meet Whitebeard. But at sea, when he was seasick, he couldn't use another Devil Fruits ability, and then I took the opportunity to capture he. 17. Blackbeard is not a man who cares about face. He bluntly said everything. Hearing this, Sengoku became even more angry. He angrily said, Bastard, if this is the case, then why did you let him off the boat? And why didn't you put conch stone handcuffs on him? Artilda, you have wronged our head. At this time, Lavit took over the words. He twirled his cane and explained, Teach originally bet Ace on the boat and prepared to hand it over to you when you came. However, Vice Admiral, the Flying Squirrel, insisted on handing over Ace immediately. Give him. What? Hearing this, Sengoku looked again at the Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral who had woken up slowly, and saw the Flying Squirrel Vice Admiral blushing and lowered his head in shame. Sengoku immediately understood that Lafitte was not lying. He asked sternly, Flying Squirrel, you are always careful in handling things, why don't you put sea stone handcuffs on Ace this time? Seeing this, Lafitte simply continued, actually, there are sea stone handcuffs on Ace, but the sea stone handcuffs can only restrict Ace's ability of a little fruit but not the ability of another fruit. A fruit ability that even Seastone can't limit? Question mark. Sengoku's tomb puckered up. This is something that has never happened before. It's okay if this is just an example. If it can be mass produced, then you will be in big trouble. Once the Seastone can't restrain some big pirates, then the only way for ordinary marine soldiers to restrain capable people will be weakened. It may even affect the current world pattern. Thinking of this, Sengoku immediately ordered, Seikezuki, Pelusino, you all take action together. Take down Ace immediately. Seikezuki felt a burst of hot face zero. He can tea handle it with Admiral alone, but Kizaru has to be with him Tilda. What a shame of shame. Woo Tilda, it's really scary to have to face Admiral teaming up Tilda. Kizaru is still the same kind of virtuous character that everything is scary Tilda. Actually, he's afraid of an egg. Sengoku looked at Blackbeard Teach again, and said, Teach, since you want to join seven warlords of the sea, you should join us and make sure to take down Ace as soon as possible. Thief ha ha ha, follow orders Tilda. With a greasy laugh, Blackbeard immediately joined the battle. The three strong generals made a move, 
and Ace was certainly no match, after a few rounds. They were at a disadvantage. He knew that if he continued to fight, he definitely had no chance of winning, so he released billowing flames from both arms, and rushed towards the big raft of the Blackbeard Pirates. Fire Dragon's wing strike. The two flames immediately overturned the four people on the big raft. Ah! Underscore. The four of them let out a scream, and all of them were thrown into the sea. Ace kicked his boat into the sea, and then jumped aboard. A slight dizziness followed. Although the fire dragon magic will make people motion sick and seasick, but the basic physique of people in pirate world is very strong, so the effect of motion sickness and seasickness is limited. But when receiving this debuff, the dragon slayer magic cannot be used. But that doesn't bother Ace either. Firepower. The ability of Mera Mera Fruit is activated, and the power of the boat is fully charged in an instant. Whoosh! The boat instantly rushed towards the sea like a 0.7 arrow off the string. But the moment the boat rushed out, a dazzling golden light suddenly appeared beside Ace. Have you ever tasted the feeling of being kicked by the speed of light? The rather forceful words, spoken in an unbeatable tone, fell into Ace's ears. Ace turned his head subconsciously, and saw Kizaru kicking him in an extremely aggressive manner. Too late to hide. Ace enters elementalization immediately. Too. Kizaru followed by the dark armament Haki Tilda. Boom. Dash. Ace's body was like a cannonball crashing back to the ground. Woo Tilda, these guys are young, but they are very strong Tilda it's scary Tilda. A streamer fell, Kizaru pouted. Sengoku rushed over immediately, and ordered, don't stand still, take him to the boat and handcuff him with sea stone handcuffs. No one is allowed to take him off the boat without my order. Yes, Vice Admiral, a flying squirrel with a bruised nose and swollen face, rushed over to handcuff Ace. Chapter 162 Talking Skeleton the best. Please subscribe. Somewhere in the sea from Sabadi Archipelago Tilda. Everyone in the Straw Hat Pirates is eating barbecue on the deck. A messenger seagull flew high in the sky. Nami waved, and the messenger seagull flew down. Nami took a newspaper from the backpack around seagull's neck and put another 100 baileys in it. Show me. Our bounty should increase a lot, right? Usopp immediately took one. His draw happened to be the first one on the reward page. Just one glance Tilda. Oh. Dash. Usopp opened his mouth into a no shape and shouted in shock. He stood up suddenly and pointed to the newspaper. Lu. Ah, Lu. Luffy, what are you doing? Nami said something contemptuously, then picked up the newspaper. Nani, she rubbed her eyes, looked at the newspaper again, and exclaimed, Luffy, your reward has suddenly increased to 420 million. What? This time, everyone was not too busy eating, and they all gathered around. Mom, it's actually true. Luffy is worth more than 400 million. What a high reward. Luffy's big brother is the second captain of the Whitebeard Pirates and the reward is only over 500 million. Luffy is almost catching up with his big brother. Wow ha ha, I'm so expensive. Luffy held her own reward order, as if holding a report card. Very happy Tilda. Nami continued to turn over the reward order in his hand Tilda. This one belongs to Liu Olan, and the reward is 370 million baileys. This is Zora's, with a reward of 32,000 fang bailey. This is mine, with a reward of 250 million baileys. This is Sister Robin's, and there is a reward of 190 million baileys. This is Sanji's, with a reward of 7,000 baileys. This is from Usopp, and the reward is also 7 billion 80,000 baileys. Choppers is also available, offering a reward of 50 baileys. Puff. When they saw Chopper's reward order, Everyone burst out laughing Tilda. Wow ha ha ha. Is Chopper's reward order wrong? Can't add a 4D? Hey, hey. Even if you add it, it's only 500,000 baileys, right? PFFD ha ha ha. Chopper's bounty is correct. Please look carefully here. Liu Olan pointed to a place below Chopper's bounty. Everyone sees. Good guy, pet. Ha 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 ha. I can't laugh anymore Tilda. Damn it. They gave me such a low reward. They really have no sense. Sanji was depressed. Although there was a reward this time, it was much lower than he expected. It's okay, I'm not tall. Zora patted Sanji's shoulder. That's your quadruple belt corner tilde. Dot. Sanji was stunned for a moment, then threw away the cigarette in his mouth and fought with Zora. Ha 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 tilde. In a burst of laughter, everyone continued to eat barbecue. In the evening, Liu Lan was painting in the studio when Robin walked in quickly. What? What's the matter? Liu Olan subconsciously put down the paintbrush in his hand. We may be being targeted. Without the usual provocative gestures, Robin said seriously. Focus on. Liu Olan looks confused Tilda. In this vast ocean, who has time to stare at us? Come out with me and take a look and you'll understand. Robin stepped forward, pulled Liu Olan and walked out. Is it so natural for this old sixth sister to grab my hand Tilda? When we came to the deck, Luffy, Usopp, Nami and little Melly were all there. And there is a big wooden barrel on the deck and a flag is planted on the barrel, which reads, Before the Sea Goddess Royal Treasure, I'll go Tilda. Liu Olan immediately understood. He remembered that there was indeed such a large wooden barrel in the original plot, 
which was put in the sea by Gecko Moria. As long as someone picks up this big wooden barrel and touches the signal launcher on it, a signal flare will be launched immediately. Then Moria's people will follow the direction of the signal flare. Dad, seeing Liu Olan coming, Little Millie immediately ran over from Nami's side. With a boost, he jumped directly to Liu Olan's mouth. Liu Olan caught it steadily, and Xiaomili hung on Liu Olan's chest like a belly band. Luffy looked at Liu Olan, and scratched his head in embarrassment. Hey Tilda we thought it was rice wine that someone else attacked Sea God. Needless to say, he must have done the opening of the big wooden barrel. Maybe it's just someone else's prank Tilda you soap guest. Robin still insisted, I think it is very likely that someone else cast the bait. Well, Miss Robin is right. In such a deep sea, it's probably a trap. Leo Lan nodded, and then spread his hands. But don't worry, if you encounter a ferocious beast, you can only be a self-righteous hunter Tilda. Wow ha ha, you are so right. Luffy raised his hands high happily revealing a mouthful of white fang. At this time, Nami looked up at the sky, wait, let's go into the cabin, it looks like there will be a storm in five minutes, quick, let's go in. Luffy waved his hand, but he slipped away first Tilda, sure enough Tilda, after a while, the storm beat down, going merry bravely marched forward in the wind and rain, and when they broke out of the storm, everyone came to the deck again. It's so strange Tilda, the place is filled with thick fog, as if cutting off the sunlight. Zara also came to the deck at this time and looked around, beside him, Frankie is holding a comic, Jano's biography, in his hand, since he just got the comics, Frankie at this time is still in the hot period of comics, and he takes the comics everywhere he goes, and he can't put it down, listening to Zara's words, Frankie looked up, and suddenly said, could it be that we have entered that legendary sea area, I'm not ready yet, hearing this, Usopp was surprised, R, have you arrived at the Fishmen Island so soon, but Luffy said, no, there is a haunted sea before that, Frankie nodded, that's right, don't be careless. Maybe this sea area is the famous Devil's Triangle. What? Trouble. Taunted dot 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 Tilda. Usopp's face was full of sweat, and he couldn't help shivering. Timidity has nothing to do with the improvement of strength Tilda. Luffy grinned. Yes. This sea area is haunted. Stop talking nonsense. Don't scare people. I haven't heard of it. Usopp yelled with all his courage, but his trembling legs exposed his heart. Seeing Usopp's funny appearance, Sanji also improvised. Grandma Kelly O told us and she also said that there are still living skeletons in this world. Then, Sanji grabbed Usopp's shoulder suddenly, and said with an expression like a ghost story, Listen, Usopp, it is said that more than 100 ships mysteriously disappear in this sea area every year. The ghost ship of the dead is cruising back and forth Tilda. Whoa whoa, why didn't you say it sooner? Usopp couldn't hold back completely, holding his head in horror. Luffy looked curious, so what if I said it earlier? Usopp hysterical, stupid. I'm so ready. I'm going to wear a magic weapon to exorcise ghosts. Share me too. Usopp Chopper pitifully hugged Usopp's leg. But at this moment, yo ho 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 Tilda. Suddenly, there was a burst of music in the mist Tilda. Everyone in the Straw Hat Pirates was subconsciously surprised. At the same time looking forward to the fog of music Tilda. Yo ho 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 ho. Yo ho 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 Tilda. As the sound of the music became clearer, in the mist, a huge ghost ship quietly appeared. Wow. Dash. For a while, except for Leo Lan and Robin. Everyone has the same expression, that is, two eyes wide open, mouth wide open, entering a state of hysterical panic. Liu Olan is a spoiler, so he knew the ghost ship would appear, and Robin dot 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 compared to what she has experienced in these years, a mere ghost ship can't touch her nerves Tilda. Yo ho 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 Tilda, yo ho 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 Tilda, what song are you singing? Few dot 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 this is the song of the ghost ship, don't listen, plug your ears and be damned, don't listen to the ghost either, if you answer you'll be dragged into the sea. Is the dot 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 is there someone on this ship? Even though Robin has seen strong winds and waves, it can be seen from the strands of sweat on her face that she is actually a little nervous. As soon as this idea came into being, I saw a head popping up in front of the deck. Ah, everyone exclaimed in unison, because that head, is a skull. It is also the next partner of the Straw Hat Pirates, Brooke. Would you like to try, holding a cup of steaming tea? Brooke greeted everyone in the Straw Hat Pirates 767 Tilda Skull dot 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 skeleton dot 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 speaking You so prolled his eyes and passed out Tilda What a clever way I dot 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 I fainted too Tilda As he said that Chopper rolled his eyes and passed out on top of you soap The corner of Nami's mouth twitched slightly I think we should stay away from this ship No I'm going on board to see Luffy threw up his hands Excited Did you make a mistake? That's a skeleton Although Sanji just told the ghost story about the skeleton he didn't really want to get in touch with the skeleton Tilda, but Luffy just insisted, I must go on an adventure on a ghost ship, I'll go with you Tilda. At this moment, Leo Lan spoke, good, let's go. Luffy immediately activated the rubber fruit ability, and stretched out his arms. Nami grabbed Leo Lan, I'll go with you too Tilda. Um, Leo Lan grabbed Nami's waist, 
then activated the rubber fruit ability, and got on the ghost ship with a whoosh. Seeing the three people appear on the deck, Brooke took off his hat and said politely, Hello everyone. Yo ho 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 tilde speaking of which, I haven't met a living person for decades, it really scared me jump. Look, he's talking, the afro is talking human. Luffy pointed to Brooke in amazement. Leo Lan smiled, yeah, the talking skeleton is the best tilde. Luffy's face brightened, then how about we invite him to join us? Leo Lan rubbed his chin and nodded seriously, I think it will work. Hey, 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 you too. Don't be so casual please. Nami people are stupid tilde. You two bastards, do you think that recruiting people into a group is just pulling a big white from the side of the road? Moreover, dot. Even if you intend to recruit skeletons into the group, wouldn't other skeletons be willing to join our organization? But at this moment, Brooke bared his teeth. Ah, sure. Ah? Nami felt that his brain suddenly became dull tilde. There is no sense of disobedience between humans and skeletons tilde. The world must be crazy. Chapter 163 That one just now is your laboon. Exclamation mark please subscribe. Yo ho 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 tilde hi hello everyone. Excuse me for interrupting, I am Brooke with only bones left after death. Please take care of me. On the deck of the Golden Mary, Brooke took off his hat and showed a gentleman's etiquette to everyone. Ha tilde, what the hell are you doing? How did you bring back a skeleton? When they saw Brooke appearing in front of them, everyone in a Straw Hat Pirates team battle widened their eyes in horror. Yo ho 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 tilde, whoops, whoops, it seems that everyone is very unfriendly. Brooke was blowing his habitual mantra, but he was very optimistic. It apostrophe s dot 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 it's a skeleton. Chop held the cross tremblingly, his face dripping with sweat. Usopp clasped his hands together as if praying, and he said to himself, impossible, absolutely impossible. How can a skeleton talk and move? and still have an exploding head. Impossible. This absolutely dreaming. Really? It turned out to be a dream. It's great Tilda. Chopper simply closed his eyes, imagining that everything would be back to normal when he opened them Tilda. The evil spirits are scattered Tilda. The evil spirits are scattered Tilda. You soap shouted nervously. At this time, Zora yelled at Luffy and Liu Olan, Hey, you guys. What the hell is going on with this guy? Luffy bared his teeth and said, Isn't it fun? I got him into the gang. What? Join? I don't agree. Zora's face is directly brushed Tilda. Then, he looked at Nami, and said angrily, What did you do? You are the only one on board who can handle you Olan, and you followed him and didn't stop this matter? Amount Tilda. Nami explained with a face full of shame, but this is what Luffy recruited. Don't lie to me. The only one who can stop Luffy is Liu Olan. Liu Olan must agree to this matter. Zora is not up to that. He looks silly, but he is actually a smart one Tilda. If Liu Olan didn't agree with this matter, he definitely wouldn't easily let this skeleton join his gang. Although Luffy is the captain. He is still very willing to refer to Liu Ogang's opinion in many cases. Since the skeleton is already standing here, there can only be one situation. Both Liu Olan and Luffy think that there is no problem with the skeleton joining the team. Yeah, Liu Olan is more excited than me. Luffy replied happily. Ahem, good guy Tilda. Without saying anything, I sold it Tilda. Immediately, Liu Olan smiled awkwardly. This matter, pay attention to eye contact Tilda. Yo ho 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 Tilda don't be so excited Tilda. At this time, Brooke stood up and acted as a peacemaker and said happily, let's all go to the cabin and have dinner together. Zora looked confused, hey, don't make up your own mind. We all sat together in the dining room. I really want to eat. I haven't eaten for decades. I have been living with the hunger on my front and back. But the skin on my front and back is gone. Only the bones are left. Brooke is simply a casual familiar, sitting at the head of the long dining table, with his hands raised up, as if giving a speech, and he didn't forget to joke. Yo ho 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 Tilda, play a little game. Everyone was expressionless and cold. Only Luffy clapped his hands excitedly. Wow ha ha ha. However, Xiamili also seems to think that the skull is very interesting. Sitting in Liu Olan's arms, giggling. He ha 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 Tilda dad. This headshot is so fun Tilda. Compared with a few days ago, Xiaomi has grown up a lot now. Physically, she is about 7 or 8 years old. But her intelligence has grown rapidly, and she can already communicate with everyone normally. Dad? Brooke looked at Liu Olan with some differences, and said in surprise, you have such a big daughter at such a young age, hey, 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 what a man with a story tilde, puff exclamation mark, everyone spat out their old gulps, and then looked at Liu Olan dumbfounded, Liu Olan shrugged, and didn't want to explain anything tilde, this matter, anyway, after a while, Brooke will understand, it's exhausting to explain now, simply, Liu Olan said very bachelorly, well, I accidentally made a mistake when I was young, so I got a son, puff, Dash. Everyone spat out a mouthful of old blood again Tilda. Ah hello, you still acted. Ha 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 Tilda dad is so humorous. Little Millie laughed out loud, and then kissed Liu Olan's side face. Seeing this scene, Nami is very envious Tilda. Robin's beautiful eyes are also flowing, and he doesn't know what he is thinking. The meal is here. At this time, Sanji came with delicious food. Beautiful Robin sauce, lovely Nami sauce, gentle Kaya sauce, 
and the cutest little Millie. This is your pre-dinner dessert Tilda. Sanji took the desserts from the tray and placed them one by one in front of the ladies. Yo ho 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 Tilda why not mine? Isn't this meal my welcome feast? Brooke stared at the two eye sockets without eyeballs, expressing his incomprehension. Don't be so self-righteous. After this meal, we'll send you back. Seeing Brooke's ignorant look, Sanji turned into a murloc mouth and spouted wildly Tilda. By the way, we ate, and Laboon also ate instead. Liu Olan suddenly thought of something, so he got up holding little Mli, and said to her, Daddy will take you to put Laboon for dinner. Okay? Of course. Roland said this on purpose to Brooke. Little Melly said cheerfully, Yeah. That's great. Laboon is so cute. Hash. Hearing this name, Brooke froze for a moment Tilda. But then, he shook his head again. I think I think too much. How can that be possible? The restaurant and the meeting room are next to each other, and the design in the middle is mostly hollowed out. So from the restaurant side you can also see the meeting room side. Leo Lan hugged little Melly with one hand, walked to the viewing platform of the meeting room, activated the rubber fruit ability with the other hand, and hugged Laboon's fish tank. When he saw that Laboon was a small fish living in a fish tank, Brooke sighed suddenly, I just said, what are you saying? Zora noticed Brooke's tone alertly, and felt that something was wrong. In his opinion, this skeleton of unknown origin must have some ulterior secret. Hey, 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 I heard that too. What did you mean by that just now? You soap is holding a cross in one hand, looking at Brooke seriously, are you planning to find a chance to bring us all? Yo ho 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 Tilda you two are really rude Tilda. Brooke curled his lips, and then explained. I just heard that little fish's name was Laboon, and I was a little emotional. Zora frowned. What? What are you feeling? Make it clear, you want to get away with it. Sanji also questioned with stern eyes. When I went out to sea, there was a whale with our pirate group. It was also called Laboon. I was so excited when I heard the name just now. But think about it carefully. Impossible. My partner Boon should be living at the entrance of the Grand Line. Logically speaking, he should grow very big tilde. Seeing everyone's doubts, Brooke simply explained clearly. But as soon as these words came out, the atmosphere in the restaurant suddenly froze. Especially Luffy, Zora, Usopp, Sanji, Nami, Kaya from East Blue. They just froze. Wait, you just said that the whale Laboon left at the entrance of the Grand Line as your partner? Nami opened his eyes wide and said in surprise. Yes. Brooke nodded, and asked with some dissonance. What? You know it? It's more than just knowing. We still. Um, Luffy shouted excitedly, and was about to reveal Laboon's life experience when Zora tightly covered his mouth. On the other hand, Robin is extremely intelligent and immediately understood what Zora meant. Although Robin is not from East Blue, she also knows about Laboon. So Robin asked, what was the name of your former pirate group? After all, just knowing about Laboon may be heard from Luffy, a fool, but about more secrets, Luffy should not say so much in detail. Brooke spread his hands. Oh, it's okay to tell you. My previous pirate group was called the Rumba Pirates, from West Blue. Aha, uh -huh. hearing this, the members of the East Blue gang all opened their mouths in surprise. Hey, 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 wait. Wait, Sanji immediately forcibly calmed down, thought of another detail, and asked, Have you made any agreement with the pirates and Laboon? If so, please explain in detail. Sanji's words immediately satisfied the partners of the East Blue Gang. If you can even answer this kind of thing, then it basically proves that Brooke is not lying. This time, Brooke was surprised. You guys even know this? Stop talking nonsense. Talk quickly. Zora scolded. Lee Kienzo. Brooke was not angry, and replied calmly, because we thought the Grand Line was too dangerous. We asked Laboon to wait a while at Upside Down Mountain, and take him home after we circled the world. MMM. Um, Luffy broke free from Zora's mouth covering, and shouted excitedly, Oh my god, so the partner Laboon is looking for is you. Nami also covered her red lips with tears in her eyes, if Laboon finds out, he will be so happy. Hey, hey, green algae head, do you think this kind of thing is likely to happen? Sanji asked Zora with his arm. Forehead, Zora grinned, although he also thought it was outrageous, but the facts were in front of him. He opened his mouth and said, it should be true. Chopper cheered, wow, it turned out to be Laboon's partner. That's great, now Laboon must be very happy. Usopp also temporarily forgot about the skeleton, and shouted excitedly, yo ho 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 Tilda, what are you talking about? Brooke looked at the crowd in bewilderment, and everyone shouted in unison, Laboon, that one just now is your Laboon. What? Dash, the skeleton is stunned. Chapter 164 Binks Wine, please subscribe. After a brief shock, Brooke suddenly laughed. He shook his head. Stop joking. My Laboon can't be that small Tilda. No. That's just what the little cards do. Nami immediately explained, but suddenly thought about what else to explain. So he said, go, go out with us and have a look and you will understand. That's right. Come with me. Laboon misses you so much. Luffy grabbed Brooke and ran outside. Seeing this, the others quickly followed out. When everyone is on deck, Brooke is just stupid. I saw a huge island whale that was many times bigger than the Golden Mary in the sea Tilda. La dot 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 Laboon. The legs with only bones left trembled involuntarily, 
and Brooke staggered to the edge of the railing, crying loudly, even though there are no tears. The sadness cannot be faked Tilda. Laboon seemed to sense something, and blinked his huge eyes, looking at Brooke. However, Chopper translated Laboon's words. Laboon says he doesn't know this person Tilda! Exclamation mark. Bastard, you liar! Sanji was furious. Zora also put his hands on the handle of the knife. Fortunately, Laboon is here, otherwise I would have been fooled by you. Nami was even more shocked and furious. Damn it, I was so moved that I was about to cry just now, it turned out to be a lie. Luffy, this skeleton must not be kept. Usopp was also immediately wary of holding the cross. Hey Tilda, Luffy also looked at Brooke with a confused face. He tilted his head, do you know Laboon? Ah, uh, suddenly, Brooke slapped his head and shouted suddenly, I understand, I'm dead, only the skeleton is left. Of course Laboon doesn't know me. 383. When hearing this word, everyone around jumped eight feet away. Hey hey hey, you finally admit that you are not human? Usopp held up the cross and shouted. No no 717 no. I'm still human, just a little different. Brooke quickly waved his hand, and then told what happened to the Rumba Pirates and the Fruit of Huang Kun. Everyone, look at me, I look at you. Although they couldn't find anything wrong with Brooke's words, they didn't fully believe Brooke's words either. At this moment, Liu Lan jumped back onto the deck from Laboon's body. Nami took Liu Lan's arm and said, he said he was Laboon's partner. But just now Chopper translated what Laboon said, and Laboon said he didn't know him. Liu Lan, if this skeleton is lying, you must firmly persuade Luffy to drive him away. Zora stared at Brooke warily. Sanji gritted his teeth and said, that's right. He lied to all of us as soon as we boarded the boat. If he was allowed to stay for a few days, he wouldn't have stolen little Millie. Hey, hey. Even though I'm a skeleton, I'm not lying Tilda. Brooke protested. He looked at Liu Olan and shouted, You must believe me. Of course Liu Olan believed him. However, the partners must be convinced. So, Liu Olan said, A person's words may be able to deceive others, but the heart can't. Let Laboon feel the fetters you have on it. With that said, Liu Olan communicated the magic power of Clow Card. The gigantic Laboon suddenly turned into a small whale that was only one meter long. As soon as Liu Olan stretched out his hand, the rubber arm made a circle on Laboon's body pulling it back from the sea. Brooke was shocked. Ah, Laboon. Don't worry, I'll use my abilities to make it smaller temporarily. With that said, Liu Olan threw Laboon directly at Brooke. Use your own method to let him know that you are his former partner. Seeing that Laboon was thrown, Brooke quickly caught it, fearing that Laboon would break. But after being hugged by Brooke, Laboon swayed nervously to the left and right, desperately trying to break free from Brooke's arms. Ah. Let go of Laboon. Liu Olan. This is not fair to Laboon. His bones hurt Laboon. Everyone in the Straw Hat Pirates shouted. Don't be impatient, I think he should be given a chance. If he can't prove it, it's not too late to drive him away Tilda. Liu Olan's words made the partners quiet for a while. Use my own method. Brooke looked at Laboon who was struggling in his arms, and he also understood that his current appearance was too scary, so he didn't blame Laboon. After thinking for a while, Brooke suddenly opened his mouth, and two rows of big white fangs started singing Tilda. Yo ho 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 ho, yo ho 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 ho. The moment this melody sounded from Brooke's mouth, Laboon, who had been struggling wildly, suddenly settled down. Not good. Laboon was strangled by him. Usopp yelled. Namiduang gave Usopp a punch in the head. Idiot, can you stop talking nonsense? Laboon has obviously quieted down. Yo ho 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 ho, yo ho 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 ho. Oh. The melody continued. Laboon became restless again from being quiet. He rocked up again. It's just, this time it's not a struggle, but an excitement. Usopp yelled again. Hey hey hey, Laboon is fighting again. No. That's not a struggle. Zora's A's were sharp, he watched Laboon's state carefully, and didn't feel afraid from Laboon. At this time, Chopper translated and said, Laboon is very excited now. He feels a familiar feeling. So dot 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 is he really Laboon's partner? Frankie rubbed his chin, analyzing excitedly. Yo ho 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 ho, yo ho 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 ho. Bring Bink's wine tilde to your side. Like the sea breeze doing whatever you want tilde riding the wind and breaking the waves. On the other side of the sea tilde. The sunset is also noisy Tilda. The song of the birds Tilda. Draw a circle in the air Tilda. Goodbye Hong Kong, the hometown of silk. Let's sing a song, the song of sailing Tilda. Gold waves and silver waves, also turned into water splashes. We leave, only because of the ocean Tilda. Send Bink's wine to your side. When the familiar singing sounded in Laboon's ears, the tears of whales flowed out of those black pupils. It's him, it's him. Chopper yelled in surprise. Laboon is sure, it is Brooke as famous minister. This time, even if I had doubts about Brooke before, now I completely believe in Brooke. Laboon called out Brooke's name directly. Obviously, they knew each other before. At least, in Laboon's memory, there must be a partner named Blue Bunch. Laboon, apostrophe. Seeing that Laboon finally recognized him, Brooke broke down in tears, hugged Laboon tightly, and pressed his bony cheeks that could no longer be warm to Laboon's face. Woo! <laughs> Laboon whined and responded vigorously to Brooke. OMG. 
This is amazing. Nami covered her cheeks. Her heart was surging. She murmured. When Liu Olan decided to take Laboon away from Shuang Zijiao, none of us thought we could find Laboon's partner Rob. Zora nodded. Yes, I was actually against it at the time. I think the same way. Sanji took a deep breath of the cigarette, filled with emotion tilde. Watching Laboon and Brooke recognize each other at this time, Sanji's eyes are also flushed. Chopper cried and said, Woo. <laughs> Pitiful Laboon Tilda. Pitiful Brook Tilda. My week is really. Ugh, it's so touching. Super. Frankie burst into tears, still doing his signature moves. Luffy laughed happily. Wow ha ha ha. This is the meaning of adventure. Yo Tilda. Liu Olan looked sideways. Luffy is such a fool. He can be enlightened. He nodded. That's right. It is because of adventurers like our straw hat pirates that we are able to realize other people's dreams again and again, etc. Suddenly, Nami shouted in horror. I seem to have discovered something terrible. What's wrong? Everyone looked at Nami. Nami pushed the mirror in his hand forward, and said in horror. Look, there is no shadow of him in the mirror. Everyone subconsciously looked in the mirror Tilda. Good guy Tilda. I saw Laboon suspended in the air upright. As for Brooke holding him dot 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 the ghost is not even visible. Ah. Look carefully. He doesn't even have a shadow. You soap also found problems. Ah. There is really no shadow. Ghost dot 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 it must be a ghost. Although I was moved by the things about Brooke and Laboon. It doesn't mean that everyone is not afraid of ghosts Tilda. Why? Brooke also heard everyone's terrified words. He sighed, and then said slowly, It's hard to say. I've been wandering in this sea for too long. Being a skeleton and having no shadow are two different things. My shadow was taken away by a man a few years ago. Brooke started to talk about the shadow Tilda. When he finished speaking, he suddenly remembered that he was not able to see the light, and suddenly felt sad Tilda. But he danced with a smile on his face. Today is really a good day. I met so many people in this gloomy sea that knows no day and night. The decades of drifting with the wind alone on this ship that doesn't even work with a rudder tilde. I'm really lonely, lonely and scared. Sometimes I really want to die. Life is long, but please be happy to me. You are happiness. Saying so, Brooke walked up to Luffy, said with a wry smile, Thank you for inviting me to join you, it's really a pleasure. But I still have to say no. Luffy was shocked. Huh? Why? Brooke said helplessly. As I said just now, my shadow was taken away. I have to stay in this sea of devils to survive. I have to stay here to get my shadow back, waiting for the miracle one day. Hey, what are you talking about? It's too strange. Hearing this, Luffy showed a sudden look, and shouted sonorously, Who took your shadow? Let's help you get it back. Chapter 165 Shadow Imitation Technique Please subscribe. You're such a nice guy. I'm grateful. But I can't tell you. Hearing that Luffy wanted to help him regain his shadow, Brooke was very moved. But he shook his head and said, I just met you, and you died for nothing for me. Are you saying the enemy is too powerful? You just need to tell me the name. Luffy looked on with enthusiasm. Brooke resolutely refused. Number. I can't say it. It's useless to say it. Let's fight to the death when I meet him myself. Don't talk about that. Let's sing. For today's encounter Tilda. Saying that, Brooke took out his cane and sword, and put on a violin bow's Tilda. But at this moment, boom. Dash. The Golden Mary suddenly violently swayed exclamation mark Tilda. Damn it. Someone hit me. On the surface of the sea, little Melly stepped on the dory propeller with both feet, as if surfing, and quickly returned to the deck. What's the situation? The front of the boat is moving so violently. Sanji immediately became alert and rushed to the deck to look into the mist Tilda. In everyone's horrified eyes, a ghost like a large doll appeared in front of everyone. Seeing this ghost, Brooke's face suddenly changed. It's not good. This ship has been monitored by this ghost. Liu Olan was a little surprised Tilda, because he found that although the ghost in front of him could be seen with eyes, he couldn't perceive it with observation Haki. It seems that the ability of devil fruit should not be underestimated. However, when Liu Olan appeared in the hand of the god-killing star, he relied on Riatsu to perceive everything about this ghost. Immediately, he raised his hand and swung around, shooting the fat ghost. Huh? God-killing star can kill ghosts. Yu Soap suddenly slapped himself on the head as if waking up from a dream. Ah, that's right. My god killing star is a soul slaying weapon. It is specially designed to deal with all souls. Immediately, the god killing star appeared in his hand. Immediately switch from the decadent Usopp to the great hero Usopp. Chopper on the side looked adoring. Okay dot 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 so amazing. Usopp. Look. The road ahead is blocked. Sanji pointed to a wall that looked like closed teeth emerging from the mist ahead. Brooke quickly rushed to the front of the deck at this time, and looked around. No. This is the back door of that ship. He came from behind. Brooke made a judgment call immediately, and then he turned to look at Luffy. Is it a drifting scale that you guys caught in the sea? Ah. 
Yeah, Luffy nodded. That was a trap. That's when your ship was targeted, Brooke said annoyedly, and then he pointed to the island slowly emerging from the mist in front of him. Look, this is the ghost island wandering in the sea, the ship of terror. Liu Olan, Luffy and Zora set their sights on one place at the same time, at the intersection of the three people's eyes, an invisible figure was approaching Nami. Liu Olan can't see people, and Observation Haki can't perceive them. But the continuous slight movement on the deck could not escape the ears of Observation Haki. It seems that Observation Haki cannot directly restrain the invisible fruit ability user, but relies on the movement caused by the invisible person to determine the direction of the invisible person. Liu Olan collected another piece of information. What are you looking at? Nami found that the eyes of the three were focused not far from her, and the woman's sixth sense told him that there was danger. Immediately, she leaned towards Liu Olan with some doubts. Liu Olan took Nami into his arms and said, we are looking at an unexpected guest who sneaked onto our boat Tilda. Remember in the original plot, this invisible man did disgusting things to Nami and Robin. It is precisely because of that move that the status of the invisible man Absalom in the hearts of fans is second only to Momonosuk. Depend on hearing what Liu Olan said suddenly, Absalom stopped immediately. Only then did he notice that there were three people looking at him Tilda. No way, is there such a thing as evil? I have done this kind of thing that steals chickens and dogs, and I have succeeded countless times, and I have never failed once. But the three people in front of me seem to have spotted me. Seriously? Immediately, Absalom raised his hand and waved to Liu Olan Tilda. AI Gang couldn't see his movements. So naturally there is no response Tilda. Cool. It turned out to be cheating on me Tilda. Absalom breathed a sigh of relief. Suddenly, his sperm began to dominate his brain again, and he leaned towards Nami with a smile on his face. But at the moment when he was about to open his mouth, Liu Olan gently pulled Nami behind him, then activated the rubber fruit ability with his right hand and grabbed the guy in front of him directly. Boom. Suddenly, there was a loud noise, and an invisible figure was smashed hard on the deck. Liu Lan couldn't see where he had caught, but he was sure that it was Absalom. Later, he wrote Usopp, Sea Stone. Coming, Usopp took out a half-moon-shaped sea stone from his carry-on bag. This sea stone is from Sky Island. It was originally inlaid on the ice blade majestic of the Sandia warrior Weipa. When the Straw Hat pirates left, Usopp and Weipa exchanged gifts. At that time, Usopp wanted this sea stone. Usopp pressed the sea stone to where Liu Olan was holding Tilda. Crash, an ugly figure appeared impressively. Ah, seeing the disgusting creature in front of him who was neither human nor beast, Nami couldn't help but screamed. Especially when she thought about Liu Olan's actions just now, she immediately understood that this disgusting creature wanted to get close to her just now. Suddenly, Nami felt nauseated Tilda. It's Absalom. Brooke looked shocked, and looked at Liu Olan in disbelief. Hey, hey. Hey, you are so strong, you can find the existence of invisible people directly. Liu Olan shrugged his shoulders. Didn't Luffy just say that you want to help you regain your shadow? Do you believe in the strength of your new partners now? But, you don't even know who you are going to face. Although Brooke marveled at the strength of Liu Olan and others, in his heart, he still felt that Moria was more terrifying. Forget it, it doesn't matter if you don't want to say it. Let's land on the island now and go to level this ghost island. Seeing that Brooke still didn't want to say it, Liu Olan didn't force it either. Anyway, it's all about defeating Moria, so why not hit it directly? You ignorant guys dare to flatten Lord Moria's island without shame, you are really ignorant and fearless. At this time, Absalom, who was suppressed by the sea stone, shouted angrily. Luffy picked his nostrils. So, the one who took Brook's shadow is called Moria? Ha ha ha. You probably don't know yet, Master Moria is a great pirate who offers a bounty of 320 million baileys, and he is even the current seven warlords of the sea. Although he was caught, Absalom didn't have any fear. Zero dot 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 seeking flowers. He firmly believed that as long as the other party knew how powerful Moria was, they would blame him for letting him go. Usopp was slightly surprised. Seven warlords of the sea? Absalom looked up. That's right. If you know you're afraid, let me go immediately. Sorry. There are already two seven warlords of the sea who lost to our pirate team. It seems that today the number will be changed to three. Usopp crouched down and gave Absalom the head. Rare opportunity to pretend. Don't pretend to be white. What? Hearing this. Absalom was surprised at first, but then he laughed loudly, there must be a limit to bragging, there are two seven warlords of the sea who have lost to you, why didn't you say that the four emperors also lost to you, everyone, look at me, I look at you Tilda, although you soap said there is a little moisture, but it is not bad, but it does sound like bragging, too lazy to talk to Absalom, everyone quickly decided on the division of labor, Luffy, Luo Lan, Nami, Sanji, Frankie and Brooke landed on the island, and the others guarded the boat. Zero, have you soap on board to prevent ghosts from sneaking around? Of course, Zora should be fine too. It's just, Liu Olan hasn't seen Zora use Zanpei Kuto until now, I don't know how his head Oi character has evolved Tilda. Before landing on the island, Liu Ogang checked the system mail. Question mark your manga fan Monkey D. Luffy's strength in the world of the manga, Zantong, has been improved, 
and Observation Haki has been upgraded to a high level. You get its Observation Haki ability simultaneously. You get points plus two. Your fan Kebi has improved his world strength in the comic, My Wife Shani Biography, and Learn the Breath of Thunder, The Shape of Three, and Gathering Mosquitoes into Thunder. You get its Thunder Breath ability simultaneously. You get points plus four. Question mark your manga fan Nami conquered fire card in the world of manga? Card Captisura, you get the fire card ability simultaneously. You get points plus four. Question mark your manga fan Usopp has cultivated the god killing star Shikai ability Frost Star in the world of the manga, Nigeria Wanai Ukun. You simultaneously get the god killing star Shikai ability Frost Star. You get points plus three. Your fan Nico Robin has improved his world strength in the comic, Yuzu Maki Naruto biography and has cultivated A-level ninjutsu and shadow imitation. You simultaneously obtain A-level ninjutsu owner imitation. You get plus four points. Question mark. Luffy's two-color haki has reached the advanced level, which is very good news. It is estimated that the distance from the fifth gear is getting closer. Kebi can cultivate Thunder's breath to the third form. Obviously his talent is not low. The cloud guard that Nami conquered this time is quite awesome. It is one of the four elements, the fire card. If you want to compare, then it is equivalent to a Mera Mera fruit without side effects. Usopp's abilities come from Hado's 60, Frost Nova. Robin wasn't as aggressive this time around. Before it was opened, there were two or three ninjutsu, but this time there is only one. But, having said that, the ten ninjutsu kings this time are quite high. Especially getting this jutsu right before the fight with Moria. Originally, Liu Olan had a shadow card in his hand, and Liu Olan could already compete with Moria's shadow fruit in terms of shadow ability tilde. Now with shadow mimicry, Liu Olan silently felt sorry for Moria for a second tilde. Old Mo, you have a bit of a back. Chapter 166 Nami makes a move and pulls out the shadow. Please subscribe. A group of six people went ashore tilde. With Zora and Usopp on board, Liu Olan is very relieved. What's more, the pervert Absalom has been soaked in a cage filled with seawater, so there is no need to worry about anyone being disgusted. I have to say that this island is really a barren and bleak scene tilde. There is a feeling of ruins everywhere tilde. Because of the dense fog, it gives people an extremely gloomy sense of fear. I said, it really makes people feel uncomfortable tilde. Frankie looked around, looking around, feeling a sudden chill. Yeah tilde, the atmosphere is a bit creepy tilde. Hearing the unknown cries from time to time, Nami shrunk his neck, and then simply grabbed Leo Lan's arm and put it on his shoulder. Well, it's more reassuring tilde. Seeing this scene, Sanji's heart was broken, and he shouted. Ah, uh, I can protect the beautiful Nami Chan Tilda. Yo ho 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 Tilda, if necessary, I can do it Tilda Brook also offered himself. Frankie grinned, wow ha ha ha. You two are really making fun of yourself Tilda. Bastard, you damn pervert, why are you as annoying as a green algae idiot? Hearing this, Sanji was furious, and then looked at Brook again. And you, you just joined, teach me to respect the seniors in the 220 team Tilda. Gulilulu. Woo. At this moment, a bandaged three-headed wolf suddenly appeared in the alley ahead Tilda. But to be precise, this should be a fake three-headed wolf composed of a wolf head plus dog head plus fox head. Hey Tilda, it's the hell three-headed dog. The moment she turned her head, Luffy burst into a smile Tilda. He is holding a net bag for catching dragonflies in his hand, and he is about to go into it Tilda. Frankie hurriedly shouted, hey, wait. That doesn't seem to be a living creature. Isn't this just a dog? Luffy scratched his head, not feeling the difference at all. Obviously not a normal dog. Okay, Liu Olan couldn't help but complain. Luffy's judgment is really confusing sometime Tilda. And at this moment, Brooke said, it's the corpses of dogs, wolves, and foxes, but Moria's ability brought them back to life. Dot. Hearing this, Nami frowned slightly, and asked suspiciously, does Moria have such abilities? Isn't that better than your devil fruit? Yo ho 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 Tilda. Brooke whistled and shook his head. It's different. My resurrection is still my original consciousness. But Moria just stuffed the shadow of a living person into the corpse, giving the corpse the ability to move. Um, Sanji suddenly understood, and he was surprised. So, your shadow was taken away and put in the body of the zombie? That's right. At the very beginning, the shadow will still maintain its own consciousness. But once it cannot return to the main body within a certain period of time, the memory belonging to the original owner will be slowly erased, and then it will only be left. Let go of the walking dead of habit and subconsciousness. Brooke nodded explaining. Damn bastard. Hearing that Moria's method was such a jerk, Nami couldn't help but clenched her little fist. While everyone is talking, Luffy has already tamed a wolf Tilda. Waha. Do you want to ride a new mount with meat Tilda? Luffy sat on the back of the three-headed wolf with a bruised nose and swollen face, and waved to everyone. Everyone refused. Without hesitation Tilda. That's a corpse. Only with a heart as big as yours can you sit so comfortably on top of a rotting corpse without changing color. Liu Olan looked at the three wolves, rubbed his chin, and said to himself, you said. The shadows in the three zombie wolves are human or wolf, are Tilda. Nami opened his mouth, and suddenly felt that the three zombie wolves were more infiltrating. Frankie thought for a while, it's all possible. 
but in this sea, it is much more difficult to catch wolves than to catch people, etc. Suddenly, Nami's eyes lit up, and she tilted her head to look at Liu Olan's profile, could it be that you want to? Um, there was no need for Nami to explain directly, Liu Olan knew that Nami understood what he meant, so he said with a smile, I want to try and see if I can get the shadow of this zombie wolf out of his body. Sanji said excitedly, it would be great if we could get it out. To put it bluntly, those shadows are equivalent to human souls who would want to be imprisoned in the bodies of these corpses. Although Sanji is a perverted cook, but the sense of justice in his heart is definitely leveraged. Let me come. Nami volunteered, and suddenly shook her small hand, and the shadow card of Clow appeared. The next moment, magical energy instantly enveloped the three wolves. I saw the shadows of the three wolves stopped moving all of a sudden. Come out. Nami shouted, and forcibly controlled the shadows of the three wolves throughout magic energy pulling them out. It was as if he was pulling a rather willful rubber band forcefully. After the shadow was stretched, it was trembling. Boo. Finally Tilda. With a clear sound, the shadows of the three wolves were suddenly pulled down. And it's not one shadow, it's three. I saw these three shadows, after a period of confusion, suddenly seem to be attracted by some kind of natural attraction, and each of them drifted towards a certain direction. Without their shadows, the three wolves naturally turned into real corpses, collapsing with a crash. Ouch. Luffy didn't pay attention, and immediately rolled off the body of the three wolves. Yo ho 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 Tilda this time I believe you guys really have the strength to compete with Moria. Seeing Nami's operation, Brooke can be said to be the most excited person. He took off his hat and bowed deeply to Nami, beautiful Miss Nami, please allow me to beg you, help me find my shadow Tilda. Nami proudly raised her chin, no problem, it's on me. Ah, Nami, you killed my new mount Tilda. Luffy got up from the ground with a very depressed expression on his face. Idiot. Nami-chan did something good yet you still blame him. You have no heart. Sanji, the flower protector, was immediately angry with Luffy. Tilda. Luffy sighed depressingly, and had no choice but to continue walking forward with the net bag on his shoulders. Suddenly, he turned his head and saw a tree man drinking with a zombie horse with a unicorn, and exclaimed, wow, the old tree and the unicorn are drinking. He immediately rushed forward, grabbed the old man tree, and laughed loudly, I got it. Frankie also picked up the unicorn zombie, I caught it too. This is indeed a rarity. Wow, let me go. This old tree is still struggling and begging for mercy like a human being Tilda. Liu Ov said excitedly, come and be a pirate with us. As soon as these words came out, everyone was furious. Your brain is flooded, dot 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 Tilda. Luffy let go of the old master tree with a look of disappointment, and continued to explore the way forward. But suddenly Tilda, negative, negative, a strange syllable floated out from the woods ahead. Did you hear anything? Luffy, who was in the lead, suddenly stopped and was about to ask everyone, but suddenly his eyes widened and he looked forward, exclaiming, wow, the ghost is out, what a ghost, Sanji and Frankie also stared wide-eyed, Nami subconsciously leaned against Liu Olan, the corners of her mouth trembling slightly, Brooke is fine Tilda, after all, he is also a ghost Tilda, huh, they can still dance, and the number is still increasing, Luffy opened a mouthful of white fang, and suddenly felt that the ghost was not scary anymore, wow ha ha, I want to catch these big whites and raise them Tilda, immediately, he picked up the big net bag and went to catch the ghost, but the net bag passed through the ghosts, but couldn't reach them. Can't you touch it at all? Coming to Frankie next to Luffy. He was surprised, and then he opened his mouth. Exclamation mark. Rumble Tilda. The fierce flame instantly enveloped the ghost Tilda, but the next moment, the ghosts emerged from the flames. No, it's useless. Frankie was about to step back when a ghost passed through his body. No, I can't do it this week. I can't do anything. I don't have the confidence to live. So let's just die. Frankie sighed dejectedly, lying on the ground, looking like he was going to die. Tilda Sanji exclaimed incredulously, Hey, it's just that the ghost was not attacked. There is no need to be lost to this level. Afterwards, Luffy also knelt on the ground with a dejected face. If there is an afterlife, I hope I can become a shell. It's too bad. Just die. What are you 0.8 guys doing? Seeing this, Nami was immediately annoyed. Tilda, at this point, I'm still joking. Immediately, she rushed over and was about to knock the heads of the two of them. Wish Tilda. A ghost passed through her body Tilda. Ah. How can I be worthy of Luo Lan? He is so handsome, strong and perfect. Nami slumped down on the ground. Puff. Sanji spurted out a mouthful of old blood Tilda. Click. Heartbroken Tilda. Luo Lan didn't expect that Nami would actually say these words after the negative ghost. I guess she will die of embarrassment later Tilda. At this time, the negative ghost floated towards them again. Not good. It must be the ghosts of these ghosts. Get back. Sanji reacted immediately and quickly reminded everyone. However, Liu Olan holds the god-killing star in his hand, and his spiritual power is surging. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Dot. Several negative ghosts were immediately killed one by one. Ah. In the castle in the distance, there was an exclamation. Chapter 167 Moria, Aokiji, come out. Please subscribe. Ah. In the castle, 
A girl wearing a crown and pink twin ponytails uttered a scream. Her eyes are dark. Her skin is fair and strange, holding a small red umbrella in her hand. She looks like a vampire in a medieval castle tilde. Although she is only a girl, she is actually one of the three carders under Mario's command. The ability user of the ghost fruit, Perona. The moment the negative ghosts were wiped out just now, Perona instantly became weak. Although the elimination of those ghosts will not hurt Perona, it will consume a lot of Perona's physical strength. The key is, the situation of these negative ghosts made Perona feel scared. On the Golden Mary before, Liu Olan eliminated a surveillance ghost. But since Perona isn't there, she only knows that one of her watch ghosts has disappeared, but doesn't know how. Now seeing with her own eyes that someone can easily destroy her ghost makes Perona terrified. Although she is a guard around Maria, it is only a cooperative relationship. If there is an enemy so powerful that even Maria can't compete, Perona will not foolishly die. Let's hide for a while. If the power of these people threatens Maria, then I'll run away Tilda. Thinking of this, Perona hurriedly started packing up Tilda. The other side Tilda. Luffy, Frankie and Nami are extremely awkward Tilda. Luffy grinned and roared. If that ghost appears again next time, I will definitely kill them. They must have weaknesses. See how I deal with them. Frankie pressed his knuckles and shouted forcefully. Nami is the most embarrassing Tilda 08. <laughs> She plunged into Liu Olan's arms, and her embarrassing toes could dig out three rooms and one living room. Ah ha ha. Liu Olan laughed, and whispered in Nami's ear, It's okay, I like your cute and shy appearance very much Tilda. Hearing what Liu Olan said, Nami's embarrassment suddenly became better Tilda. But, this place really stinks Tilda. Luffy regained his sanity at this time, he sniffed the air, and suddenly felt nauseous Tilda. Liu Olan curled his lips, This island is almost full of corpses, no wonder it doesn't stink. Fortunately, it's gloomy here all day long. If there is sunshine, the smell, I guess it can stink ten miles away. Dead. Let me set it on fire. Frankie's arm popped out, and a flamethrower appeared, dousing the ground all at once. Ah, ah. It's hot. Where the flames burned, a large number of zombies crawled out of the ground, their bodies were steaming. Instantly made the whole area even more stinky. You stupid. Sanji was furious. Ice age. Underscore. Nami immediately pressed down with his palm and the magic power of the combo surged Tilda. The cold air rushed to the ground in an instant. Ka 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 ka. The surrounding temperature dropped below zero in an instant, and the ground froze into ice in an instant, spreading far into the past. Wherever they passed, the zombies that had just crawled out of the ground were all frozen into ice cubes. This time, even the air has become much fresher Tilda. Wow, still Nami-chan is amazing. Sanji had little red hearts in his eyes and a flattering expression on his face. Let's also rescue the shadows in these zombies by the way. Liu Lan reminded, and then began to use the power of the shadow card. Um, Nami also immediately followed Liu Lan's actions. One after another, shadows emerged from the bodies of these zombies, and then floated in other directions. Why does this shadow float towards that forest? Frankie looked at the direction in which the shadow was flying, and looked around curiously. Yo ho 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 tilde. That forest is a good place for shade. If I'm not mistaken, it must be because there are many victims hiding in that forest. Brooke said analytically. Wow. My shadow is back. Mine is back too. My god. A miracle really happened. I thought I was going to be stuck here for the rest of my life. It must be a miracle. At this moment, a lot of cheers were heard from the woods. Hey? Someone really is there. Luffy looked over in surprise, and then smiled happily. A group of people walked all the way, frozen all the way tilde. When we got to the front of the castle. There was already a world of ice behind us. Moria, get out of here. Give him back Brooke's shadow. Luffy yelled at the castle without any bells and whistles. This is his style. With the addition of Haki's external sound, Luffy's roar was like thunder, directly waking up all the zombies in the castle. Um, Moria, who was sleeping soundly, woke up suddenly. He rubbed his relaxed sleepy eyes and muttered to himself in a daze. Am I hallucinating? Immediately, he shook his head. Yes, in this sea area, how could someone break in here? What's more? He dared to scold me in that tone, but his voice just fell. Moria, get out. Luffy's roar was like thunder. Nanny. At this moment, Moria sat up suddenly, with a shocked expression on her face. Bastard, someone really scolded me? Question mark. Moria immediately looked at the two picture scroll zombies on the wall, and ordered, Go, tell Absalom and Perona to come see me. With Moria's order, two bat zombies flew out of the scroll and rushed out of the window. What a bastard. Someone actually broke into this place and disturbed my sweet dreams. I will never let them go lightly. Moria is very angry now. In his opinion, it must be the fault of Absalom and Perona for the enemy to break into here. With the devil fruit ability of those two people, no one should be able to break into the island smoothly. Taking a step back, even if someone really broke in, then at least he should be notified immediately Tilda. Why not let him be woken up by the shouts of the enemy? Boom, boom. At this time, the glass on the window burst suddenly, 
and two stones flew in and landed at Moria's feet. Um, but when Moria's eyes fell on these two stones, she suddenly turned pale with shock, because this is not a stone at all, but the frozen ice cubes of the two bat zombies that flew out just now. Dot. All the zombies connected to credit were frozen, and Moria's anger value soared, but suddenly, etc. This frozen, Moria's complexion suddenly changed. Okiji what is he here for? Without any doubt, Moria was sure that Okiji was coming. Clatter Tilda. He turned into a wave of shadow bats and flew out outside the castle Tilda. Here we go. This is Moria. Seeing these shadow bats, Brooke immediately reminded everyone to be careful. Aha Tilda, Moria is not human. Luffy tilted his head, his face full of question marks. Fool, you are not human. Angry roars came from the group of shadow bats, and when they landed, they turned into Moria. However, Luffy didn't pay any attention to his words, but said in surprise, Hey Tilda, how did it become an onion again? Puff. Ha ha ha. The partners of the Straw Hat Pirates were suddenly amused by Luffy's brain circuit Tilda. Ah, Moria felt her blood pressure soaring Tilda. Nima. This is a wonderful thing that came out of nowhere. He decided to stop talking nonsense like this. Instead, he looked around and asked coldly, Where is Okiji? Ah what Okiji? Luffy's expression became serious again. He put one hand on his hip, pointed at Moria with the other hand, and asked, where is Brooke's shadow? Stop talking nonsense. Answer me first. What's the problem? Seeing that the entire island is a world of frost, Moria is really angry now. Although Okiji is Marine Admiral, powerful, but his current identity as Moria is seven warlords of the sea, and he is united with Marine. He's going to really question Okiji why he's helping other people deal with him. Stop talking nonsense. Hand over Brooke's shadow. Once Luffy's temper gets stubborn, ten cows can't pull it back. What Brooke? I have no idea who you're talking about. Seeing that the little dwarf in front of him didn't know how to compliment, Moria scolded impatiently. Then, he yelled at the surroundings, Okiji, come out to me, turn my island into this, what do you mean? Wow ha ha, ha ha. When they saw Moria, they recognized Okiji, and everyone in the Straw Hat Pirates burst into laughter. Actually, dot. Nami was about to tell the truth, but was interrupted by Liu Lan. Then, Liu Lan simply added insult to injury and said flickeringly, the love is over just now, gone. Hearing this, Moria didn't doubt it. After all, here is what frozen fruit did Tilda, and he yelled several times just now, but Okiji didn't show up. Other than that Okiji was gone, it couldn't be any other reason. Moria asked coldly, why did he freeze my island? How could I know? Liu O Lan spread his hands, and said disdainfully, maybe, he probably thinks you are ugly Tilda. Ugh, Moria can't take it anymore. These guys Tilda, say he is an onion for a while and say he is ugly for a while. Go to hell with me. A fierce look appeared on his large shoehorn-like face. He grabbed the void beside him, and a black shadow condensed from his hand. Multi-shadow horn gun. Chapter 168 The aggrieved Moria, accused of death. Please subscribe. What is that? Frankie looked shocked, and immediately put on a defensive posture. Stop. Nami's magic power surged, and he pointed at the flying shadow horn guns. I saw those flying shadow horn guns instantly freeze in the air tilde. Scatter. Nami whispered again. I saw that the shadow horn gun turned into a cloud of shadow energy and dissipated. Oh, seeing this scene, Luffy was as happy as a child, clapping his hands and shouting, Nami is amazing. Yo ho 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 tilde. Brooke also hummed happily. From the looks of it, he looks stable. Nanny. Underscore. Moria's eyeballs are about to pop out. He couldn't believe what he just saw Tilda. That is one of his most proud attack skills. Since he developed this ability, he will use the shadow horn gun in almost every battle Tilda. Although sometimes it will be flashed by others, but this situation of being cancelled by others is the first time in so many years. Damn it, you little girl, what did you do to my shadow gun? Realizing that these little guys in front of him were not as simple as they appeared on the surface. Shariah became vigilant. Stop talking nonsense. Hand over Brooke's shadow first. Nami didn't want to say anything more to him, so he immediately turned back. Depend on. Moria is really upset today. These people, one or two talking arrogantly will die. You really don't care about me, Moria, you bastards. Don't let you taste the power of my Moria, you don't know how to write the word fear. With that said, he released a large number of shadow bats. Shadow box. These shadow bats all flew towards Nami's direction. But before they came to Nami, Nami pointed again. Scatter! Exclamation mark dot. Just like the sound of bubblegum bursting, these shadow bats suddenly exploded one by one. Then it turned into scattered shadow energy, matching. This is impossible. This time, Moria's mouth opened as big as a dipo tilde. He looked at Nami in disbelief, as if he had seen a ghost. How dot 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 how dot 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 how? Stunningly patted her own face, Moria was a little suspicious of life's opening. Who are you, my fruit ability? Liu Olan immediately took over the conversation. What devil fruit ability? She used Haki to clean up your shadow. Hey Tilda, really? Luffy believed it first, and widened his eyes. Teach me Tilda question mark Tilda. Don't get in the way Tilda. Sanji directly dragged Luffy over. As soon as Liu Olan spoke, 
Sanji knew that Liu Olan was trying to fool Moria, but Luffy is not stupid. Sanji felt a headache tilde. Nami also immediately understood Liu Olan's black belly, so he said cooperatively, Yes, isn't it just relying on Haki? It's such a simple thing, you just need to learn a little bit. Hey he he he, Moria grinned, are you treating me like a three-year-old? Question mark. I don't know about Haki. Although Haki can resist devil fruit to a certain extent, but I want to directly control my shadow power, that is absolutely impossible. As a guy with a non-low IQ, it is certainly impossible for Mariah to believe such nonsense. You do not believe? Hearing this, Liu Olan grinned, and then waved, come on, use your shadow ability on me again, and I'll show you a Haki broken shadow too. Question mark. Maria frowned. This guy, seriously, with such a confident appearance, can Haki really be able to crack the shadow ability? Question mark. No, impossible. He must be bluffing. Thinking of this, Moria waved her hand. Double shadow horn gun. Two sharp shadow horn guns swished towards Liu Olan. Stop it. Liu Olan pointed. In order to act more realistically, he wrapped Haki around his arm and released some Haki by the way. How can this be? Seeing that not only Nami can do it, but also Liu Olan can do it, Moria really can't do it tilde. Scatter. When Liu Olan moved again, he saw the two shadow horn guns dissipate. Damn it, you guys are weird. I won't play with you geese today. Moria is also extremely decisive, turning around and running. Everything is so weird today. It's better to show off first, and wait until you get the other party's information, and then count. Want to run? Hand over Brooke's shadow. Luffy rushed up with a stride, his fist stretched back. Rubber rubber? Ape King gun. A shot is a big move tilde. The huge fist, wrapped in the jet black armament haki slammed into Moria's back like a speeding train. F.K. Seeing Luffy's attack momentum, Moria murmured in her heart. These people. It seems that everything is so simple. But, he 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 he. Your attack seems scary, but it's useless to me. Moria ran for some distance and realized that she couldn't dodge Luffy's attack, so she stopped and turned to face Luffy's Ape King spear. Shadow. Boom. Dash. Luffy's fist hit him instantly. B. With a whoosh, Luffy's fist went straight through and slammed heavily on the opposite castle wall. Rumble tilde. This half of the castle just collapsed. Ugh. Moria's roar erupted from a corner. And the Moria hit by Luffy just now turned into a black shadow without any entity. It's not elemental either, so armament Haki can't capture the solidity of the shadow either. Moria originally just wanted to get rid of the golden cicada by relying on the ability of the shadow dancer, and flirt with Luffy by the way. But he didn't expect that Luffy's punch directly blasted half of his castle, and he was so angry. But this also strengthened his idea of running away immediately. Without a second's hesitation, Moria turned and ran. But as soon as he took a step, his feet seemed to be firmly bound by something, and he couldn't lift his feet at all. What happened? He looked at his feet and couldn't see anything at all. But that powerful binding force is real. Damn. Guy with a straw hat, what did you do? Question mark. Moria looked at Luffy and asked in shock. Hut Hilda? Luffy scratched his head and said with a confused face, I don't know. I didn't do it. Moria looked again at Sanji. Frankie and Brooke. We didn't do it. Either Tilda the three waved their hands quickly. It's you too. Moria's eyes fell on Liu Olan and Nami. It shouldn't be me Tilda. Nami spread her hands, expressing her ignorance. It's me. Liu Olan smiled. I've been waiting for your shadow to appear, and it's finally here. I saw that Liu Olan was making a special seal gesture, and the shadow under his own feet was now connected to the shadow that Luffy missed just now. Others don't know, but Liu Olan, as a time traveler, definitely knows that that shadow is Moria's own shadow. Moria can switch her body and shadow at will, so as to achieve a physical invincibility effect. B. This ability was defeated by Tank in front of the shadow imitation technique. If you use the shadow card of the cloud card, although it can also affect Moria's shadow, it can't achieve such a good effect. I was able to easily control Moria's shadow ability just now, that's because those are all shadow energy areas. And Moria, as a shadow fruit capable person, his control over his own shadow is super. Wang Luo. Amazing. Liu Olan tried it just now, and Moria's shadow couldn't be shaken by just choosing the shadow card. But when shadow mimicry is connected to Moria's shadow, the effect appears. Certainly, this effect cannot be fully controlled. After all, this is Moria, who also plays shadows. If it is someone else, then complete control can be achieved. Liu Olan controls Moria's shadow, which is equivalent to controlling Moria's body. Luffy, knock him down now. Good. Luffy's fist stretched back again tilde. Rubber rubber? Ape King gun. The huge fist was like a small hill blasting towards Moria in front. Ah! Bastard. Moria was extremely anxious and fought desperately. Private. But even though he was able to pull his heels slightly, he couldn't break free completely. Hateful, with an unwilling roar, Moria stared helplessly at Luffy's fist. Come with a bang exclamation mark tilde. Chapter 169 The Shadow Gathering Place. The target Moria. Please subscribe. Boom. Moria was punched into the ruins. Her nose was bruised and her face was swollen tilde. He struggled to get up, wanting to fight back but his shadow was firmly restrained by Liu Lan. As a result, he can only do some small auxiliary movements, 
basically a target tilde, Luffy, keep attacking, as long as you knock him unconscious, those shadows should be released. 7 inches, Liu Olan said while controlling Moria. Good. Hearing this, Luffy blew on his right hand again, and the Ape King gun is ready again. Ah, damn it. Moria's face was shocked. He had already felt the power of this punch just now. If he was to be punched again now, he felt that he should not be able to bear it. As a big pirate who once fought with Kaido in New World, Moria doesn't want to capsize in the gutter tilde. With a movement of his palm, a pair of shiny scissors appeared in his hand. Shadow cut. Without any hesitation, Monica picked up her own shadow and could cut it off directly. Clatter tilde. Mordia turned into a bunch of bats and fled in all directions when Luffy's fists came crashing down. FK tilde. Seeing Moria's actions, Liu Olan admired Moria's decisiveness. This guy actually cut off his own shadow so simply. He is really worthy of the title of Big Pirate. You know, when Moria's shadow is on him, there is no way for Liu Lan and Nami to control Moria's shadow with the power of the silver medal. But now, the shadow of Molly 800 is cut off by himself Tilda. In this way, this shadow is temporarily unowned. Whether it is Liu Lan or Nami, as long as they use the power of the shadow card a little, they can completely capture Moria's shadow. The shadow of Nami Moria is delivered to you. Liu Olan used shadow imitation to control Moria's shadow and came to Nami. Shadow card. The magic power of the cloud card floated in Nami's hand, completely capturing Moria's shadow. Moria, now your shadow is in our hands. We trade your shadow for Brooks, Opair. Luffy clenched his fists, looked at Moria who was already standing far away, and wanted to seek a deal. Hey he 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 he, what are you thinking about? Moria grinned and looked at the straw hat pirates with a confident look on his face, you stupid rookie adventurers, don't you think that you have won the battle just now, you lost even your own shadow, so is there any chance of turning things around, Frankie pointed to the shadow of Moria controlled by Nami, and asked excitedly, hey he 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 he, then let you guys really open your eyes, with a relaxed smile on his face, he spread his hands and shouted, shadow gathering place, as soon as his voice fell, jet black shadows suddenly appeared on the ground, like ghosts, frantically gathering towards Munya. What's this? When several shadows passed under his feet, Frankie jumped up with a cry. Where are there so many shadows? Sanji also raised his feet, and seemed to feel that those shadows were a bit penetrating. He ha he. These shadows are collected by me over the years, and I usually put them in the bodies of zombies to build my zombie army. But when I take all these shadows back into my body, these shadows it will become part of my strength. While speaking, as shadows continued to pour into Moria's body, his size also continued to enlarge. In the blink of an eye, Moria who was originally about 7 meters tall, soared to a height of more than 10 meters in an instant. Of course, his figure is also several circles thicker than before. Now, I have gathered the power of 1000 shadows, do you know how terrifying this is? With strength in hand, Moria is not busy now. He looked at the people of the Straw Hat Pirates, raised his arm, and showed them the power he had just gained. Oh! Underscore W. Luffy's eyes widened, interested in Moria's form of gaining power. Waha, come on, let's compete again. Luffy turned on fourth gear ready to fight again, but Liu Olan smiled and pulled Luffy back, don't bother, to tell you the truth, I'm waiting for him to use this trick Tilda, hey Tilda, Luffy tilted his head, and several question marks appeared, Moria also said unremittingly, stop being alarmist, you have worked so hard to control one of my shadows, and now I have 1000 shadows, what do you compare to me, ahaha, your shadow is difficult to control, that's because you are a person with the ability of the shadow fruit, but the shadows you absorb now are just the shadows of ordinary people, Liu Lan spread his shoulders and said with a smile, I believe you are a smart person, so I don't need to say anything yet Tilda, click, hearing what Liu Lan said, Moria was shocked, it seems dot 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 it makes sense, immediately, he planned to strike first, shadow gathering fist, an arm that was 7 or 8 meters long slammed in the direction of Liu Olan and Nami, Modia is not an idiot, from the battle just now, he can understand that the two people who have the ability to restrain him are Liu Olan and Nami, if these two people are dealt with first, then this battle will be a sure win, useless tilde, Liu Olan curled his lips, then pointed to Moria's arm, stop, as soon as these words came out, Moria's arm stopped instantly as if a switch had been pressed, my week was really, ha ha ha, it was so much fun, well, super, seeing Moria under control again, Frankie danced excitedly, arsehole, realizing that she was in serious trouble, Moria quickly swung her other arm, trying to attack Liu Olan, Knami pointed with a small finger, stop, immediately, Moria's arm also stopped Tilda, afterwards, Liu Olan looked at Luffy, Luffy, it's time for you to perform, Give me all the shadows in his body. Ha ha, good. This kind of thing is Luffy's favorite Tilda. Rubber gun. The arm stretched, and then slammed into Moria's stomach. PFFT Tilda. One punch made Moria squirt wildly Tilda. I saw black shadows spurting out of his mouth fiercely like gastric juice. Huh? Can you still do this? You are so funny. Sanji immediately opened the fourth gate of the eight inner gates, and rushed up with one step. Sanji big whirlwind. Underscore. 
The terrifying force kicked Moria's mouth tilde, pfft. Underscore W, another large number of shadows were sprayed out. I want to try it too. Frankie's arm turned into a hammer, and when he caught Moria, he gave him a hard hammer tilde, pfft. Bastards, Moria's beaten shadow vomited blood together, almost collapsed. He is a majestic seven warlords of the sea, a big pirate who once fought against Kaido, and now he has become the target of this group of rookies. What's more, when they beat Moria, they even exchanged experience with each other talking about how to punch more shadows. Yo ho 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 tilde wwww. Suddenly, a shadow floated out and made such a soft humming sound. My shadow. Brooke rushed up quickly and grabbed the shadow of the combination tilde. The next moment, Brooke shouted excitedly, Yo ho 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 ho. I can see the sun. Here, Luffy punched more than ten punches in a row, and saw that there was no shadow coming out. You nasty bastard, it's time to beat you up. Woof stepped on his feet and the black haki soon covered his whole body. Rubber rubber super great ape king gun. With a run-up sprint, the ape king gun, which was as big as a castle, hit Moria's body. Boom. Moria's fat body is like a rocket, soaring straight into the sky. Chapter 170 Shiki, your bounty is very attractive. Please subscribe. Leaving the sea of mist, the golden Mary sailed in the direction of the Seibadi archipelago. This trip didn't yield much. I just caught an Absalom worth tens of millions. Perona never showed up from start to finish. Moria gets punched by Luffy flies away. But it's not a pity, because Moria is still seven warlords of the sea, even if he is brought to the marine base, there is no way to exchange for bounties. In the manga studio tilde, yo ho 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 tilde wwww, Brooke pushed the door open and bowed to Liu Olan in a very gentlemanly manner, I heard that there is something good for me, what an exciting news. Well, take this manga and read it tilde. Liu Olan pushed forward a comic book on the table. Comics. Question mark. Hearing this, Brooke was a little surprised. Do all the people on our ship like this? On the way to the comic studio just now, Brooke passed the reading room and found that several partners were holding the comics in the reading room and reading them fascinated. Pirates reading comics. This kind of thing is really unbelievable. Ouch tilde. When Brooke got the comic book, he saw a skull on a motorcycle on the cover. The skull's eyes, ears, and mouth are full of terrible flames. Dear Mr. Liu Olan, you are really good at picking. I am very interested in this comic book. He 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 tilde. Although he didn't know what Liu Olan gave him the comic book for. But when he saw that the protagonist of this comic was also a skeleton, Brooke still had a strong interest. Obviously, this comic book was drawn by Liu Olan specially for Brooke, and it was just finished yesterday. After Brooke left, Robin walked in with little Lee. Daddy hugs. The slender little heel twitched a few steps and little Mealy jumped onto Liu Olan's body. Oh tilde, Liu Olan subconsciously stood up and picked it up, giving Xiao Mealy to Yuan Zhu. Let me see if our little Mealy has grown beautiful again tilde. Liu Olan hugged Xiao Mealy and walked to the mirror, and gave a baby shake tilde. By the way, why did you bring little Melly here all of a sudden? As if thinking of something, Liu Olan turned to look at Robin. Dad, I'm hungry. Before Robin could speak, little Melly explained why they came. Hey tilde, hungry? Question mark. This was the first time that Little Millie said she was hungry after eating Bozu Adam last time. On weekdays, Little Millie also eats three meals a day, just like a normal person. Then let Sanji Uncle cook you a big meal, okay? Liu Olan supported Xiao Millie with one hand, and gently scratched Xiao Millie's nose with the other hand. Robin immediately said, No. He probably wants to eat wood. Eat Mew Mew Eat Mew Mew. Little Millie put her arms around Liu Olan's neck, shaking tenderly. I want to eat wood again. Hearing this, he suddenly thought about the course at this time, so he said, Well, wait a moment, little Mealy, when you reach the island ahead, there will be a lot of Mew Mew Tilda. Yeah, daddy is so nice Tilda. As she said that, Xiao Mealy slapped Liu Olan on the side of her face. The corner of Robin's mouth twitched slightly Tilda. You little guy, relying on his special status. He really can do whatever he wants. Time flies, and a few days have passed. Going Mary sailed away from the Misty Sea completely. In the comic studio. Liu Lan checked the system mail. Question mark your manga fan Nami conquered Yunka in the world of manga? Card Kaptisura? You get the dream card ability simultaneously. You get points plus two. Question mark your manga fan Rora Noizora has improved his world strength in the manga? Zaraki Kenpaki biography? And armament Haki has been promoted to a high level. You gain its armament Haki ability simultaneously. You get points plus five. Question mark your manga fan Usopp has cultivated the ability of Shikai, the god killing star. Liu Oxing in the world of the manga? Essence of two houses. You simultaneously get the God Killing Star Shikai ability Kong Liu O Crossing. You get points plus five. Your fan Nico Robin has improved his world strength in the comic, Use you Maki Naruto biography, and he has cultivated A level ninjutsu clone Big Blast. You simultaneously obtain A level ninjutsu clone blast. You get plus four points. Question mark. Your manga fan Frankie has improved his world strength in the manga Geno's biography, 
and practiced high voltage electric current fist. You get high voltage current punches simultaneously. You get plus four points. Question mark. Your fan Brook has improved his strength in the world of the comic. Ghost Rider? And cultivated the fire of hell. You simultaneously gain hellfire. You get plus five points. Question mark. The dream card is a cloud card that can predict dreams. The effect of this cloud card is remarkable tilde. It can also come in handy at critical times. On Zora's side, after Luffy, his two-color haki has finally reached the advanced level. Judging from the current situation, he and Luffy can reach the level above T1 in this world just by relying on their attainments on haki. The ability you soap got this time is a very good perception system Bakudo ability. From the 77th of Bakudo Tanting Kong Luo, this ability uses Riatsu to search for, capture and transmit information on the locations of multiple targets. It can be said that if you soap uses this ability well, it will be no less than the advanced observation haki. The ability Robin got this time is clone blast, which is one of the A-level ninjutsu that Itachi is very good at using. Use shadow clone as bait to lure your enemies into the trap. If the enemy attacks his clone, the powerful explosion of the wind will teach the opponent to be human tilde. Especially for Robin, he can use a large number of arms to seal at the same time, create a terrifying number of shadow clone, and then make these shadow clone explode. About a week after Frankie got there, Geno's biography, he finally succeeded in obtaining the ability from the comics. Brooks report card surprised Liu Lan. Only a few days after I got, Evil Ghost Rider, I have already practiced the fire of hell. Then next, this skeleton style will be so cool tilde, rumble tilde. At this moment, the Golden Mary suddenly vibrated violently. Um, Liu Lan saw the outside from the window, and there were no islands or waves around. What's the situation? Of course. He will understand the next moment. Because going Mary floated straight up into the sky. Liu oh Lan, it's bad. Our boat is floating in the air. Nami rushed in holding the little Lily. Don't worry, what are everyone else doing? Liu oh Lan already knew what was going on in his heart, so he didn't hesitate at all. Except for you soap observing from the watchtower, everyone else is reading manga at this point in time. Then his little Melly walked up to Liu oh Lan and asked again. Do you need me to wake everyone up? No need. Liu oh Lan shook his head and put down the paintbrush in his hand. Just right. The enemy that will appear soon, you soap, you and I happen to be the most suitable to deal with him. Zero dot 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 seeking flowers. Hey Tilda, do you know who it is? There was a surprised look in Nami's eyes. Liu oh Lan is too good. Even without going out to have a look, you know who the enemy is? Actually, it's not hard to guess. The ability of devil fruit that can float a pirate ship as big as ours is actually just one or two Tilda. And the one who can do this kind of thing in the sea area is basically the lion fruit ability user who escaped from the deep sea prison 20 years ago. Golden Lion Shiki. Liu Olan analyzed. I see. Nami understood. Walked to Liu Olan's side immediately. Took his arm. And said with a happy face. Then this time. The two of us will deal with the bad guys Tilda. And me. I want to fight bad guys with my dad too. Little Mary raised her little hand. Okay, let's join together, Little Melly. Liu Olan dotingly gave her a gentle look. By the time they reached the deck, the Golden Mary had already risen very high in the air. Liu Olan, the situation is not good. You soap spoke from the watchtower. Gee ha 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 ha. Zero. Suddenly, a wild laughter came from the sky. I saw a guy with disheveled hair, with two swords on his feet, floating in the air. Impressively official Golden Lion Shiki. Seeing this scene, you soap was shocked. Hey hey hey, how did you manage to stand in the air? Gee ha 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 ha, I am a lion fruit user, and everything I touch will automatically float. The golden lion shiki grinned. Good guy. Sure enough, as long as you are an ability user in the pirate world, if you like it, you can introduce your devil fruit ability. Outrageous Tilda. Seeing the three of them stand below, golden lion laughed wildly. You are under my control now, if I throw your pirate ship down, you will only die. Then he went on to say, listen, as long as you listen to me and serve as my subordinates. You can live well. Looking at the confidence of Golden Lion Shiki, Liu Olan shrugged his shoulders, and then looked at you soap. You soap, the safety of the Golden Lion Shiki is entrusted to you. As for the coxcomb head, I will leave it to Nami and me. Receive. You soap does a confident look. Gee ha 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 ha. Golden Lion Shiki laughed wildly. Hey Tilda, you cute little rookies, where did you get your confidence? He looked at Liu Olan with a mocking look. If you knew who I am, you wouldn't be able to say such things. Now, I'm in the air and you don't even have a chance to attack me. What are you using against me? As soon as he finished speaking, he saw a pair of small wings growing out of Liu Olan and Nami's backs and flew up. Did someone tell you dot 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 your bounty is really attractive? Although Golden Lion Shiki's current strength is not as good as before, but with his previous achievements, if he is handed over to Marine now, let alone a billion or so, he won't be able to run away. Just came out of the Devil's Triangle Sea area, did not earn any extra money, Liu Olan is depressed. Unexpectedly, Golden Lion Shiki will come to your door on its own initiative. Good man. Chapter 171 How about? I pull the helm from your head. Please subscribe. Nanny. Suddenly seeing Liu Olan and Nami flying up at the same time, 
Golden Lion opened his mouth wide in shock. Hey, 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 what's going on with you two? I obviously don't have the ability to use Lion Fruit on you. How did you come up here? Of Lion Fruit's ability, isn't that the average person? Liu Olan and Nami surrounded Golden Lion Shiki one after the other. Bastard, go to hell. Liu Olan's self confidence made Golden Lion feel seriously unhappy. He no longer hesitated and took the lead in attacking Liu Olan. Slash wave. I saw the knife under his feet slashed forward and a wave of sword chi slashed straight at Liu Olan. Then he attacked backwards with the other foot, and another wave of sword energy went straight to Nami. Shields, shield. Liu Olan and Nami almost thought of going together, using their shields at the same time. Nami is so happy. This is probably the legendary tacit understanding tilde. The two sword slashing waves hit the energy barrier formed by the shield without causing any ripples tilde. What? What is that devil fruit ability? Golden Lion's eyes widened and his face was full of incredulity. Although his current strength has degraded, a lean camel is bigger than a horse. Even for him now, the slashing wave of sword energy released by him is definitely not something that any cat or dog can block 803 tilde. The two people in front of them looked very young, and they didn't seem to be capable at all. Ignoring Golden Lion's doubts, Liu Olan looked directly at Nami. How about we give him a world of ice and fire? Okay, Nami is also very interested in Liu Olan's proposal. Immediately, she flipped her small hand and the fire card of the cloud card appeared in her hand. Call Tilda. A large number of flames rushed towards the Golden Lion in an instant. What? Logia ability users. Golden Lion was taken aback, and quickly opened armament Haki fully. At the same time, he retreated quickly, trying to avoid the edge of the flame. Only, a cold chill suddenly struck from behind him Tilda. Golden Lion turned his head and looked. I rely on. The air behind him froze into ice in an instant, and came towards him. Frozen fruit. Everyone in Golden Lion was dumbfounded. They couldn't believe what they saw. The old man just stayed in the sky for a while, has one of the marine admirals died already? If marine admiral Okiji hadn't died, his frozen fruit would never have fallen into the hands of others. Lion Majesty Gosso Errol. Without any hesitation, Golden Lion hastened to activate his abilities tilde. The surrounding air seemed to be grasped by an invisible big hand, crushed to one place in an instant, and appeared at the feet of the Golden Lion. The air condensed into the shape of a lion, and it jumped up violently, pushing the Golden Lion up. Hulalu tilde. Ka 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 ka. The ice and the flame collided together at this instant, and the terrifying energy ripples caused the surrounding air to emit terrible noises. What the hell am? Golden Lion cursed angrily, didn't stop there, and immediately flew upwards. Originally, I wanted to catch a group of thugs, but I didn't expect to kick the iron board. Hey, old man, you fly so high, be careful of thunder, Liu Olan shouted. Ji ha 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 Thunder? Why is it thundering in this sunny day? Boy, you're amazing. The old man is going to take a step first. Run away if you can't beat it. The lion is also decisive. Anyway, the Golden Mary has already been modeled by him. As long as he does not remove the devil fruit that is acting on the Golden Mary, he can control the ship to float upwards. In his opinion, when the time comes, these two little bastards will come and beg him to let the crew on this ship go. Hack. In the clear sky, a bolt of lightning crashed down. Nanny? Question mark. The whole body was covered in pitch black scorched smoke. Golden Lion was almost stunned by a thunder tilde. This shit, what a bolt from the blue. Hack. Dash. Before he could think about it, the second bolt of lightning fell and hit him accurately. This time, no matter how stupid he is, you also understand that these two lightning bolts were created by the two young men below. He didn't have time to think about why the ability users of Mera Mera Fruit and Frozen Fruit could release lightning. All he wanted now was to run away as soon as possible. Lion Majesty release. Underscore. Golden Lion immediately relieved the buoyancy acting on the Golden Mary. You two relentless bastards, you brought this on yourself. Keep chasing if you have the ability. I can't believe you two don't care about the life and death of the rest of the crew. Immediately, the Golden Lion stopped continuing to rise, but looked down leisurely. But when he looked at it, he saw that Liu Olan and Nami had already caught up. Yo don't run away tilde. Liu Olan hugged little Mili, and looked at Golden Lion playfully. Golden Lion was furious. Bastard, your ship has fallen, can't you see it? Nami spread his hands, we are not blind, of course we saw it Tilda. Then you are not in a hurry at all? Golden Lion asked incredulously. Leo Lan smiled, what's the rush? There are partners on board, they can handle it? Question mark. Golden Lion frowned fiercely Tilda. Can this be done too? It was also at this time that the Golden Mary was about to hit the sea. I saw a water blue energy hammock appear out of thin air. Duang, 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 Duang Tilda. The Golden Mary landed on the hammock and bounced a few times before regaining its stability. The next moment, the hammock disappeared, and going Mary fell less than a foot to the surface of the sea. The whole process was done in one go, without any sloppiness. Golden Lion panicked even more. Depend on, didn't he I kick the iron plate? I am damn, this is the iron plate. Made, run away. Golden Lion desperately flew upwards, with the clouds above his head. As long as he entered the clouds, 
he could rely on the clouds to cover him. However, he hadn't been flying for long when he heard a voice coming from the clouds above, Rubber King Ape Gun. Underscore, Leo Lan pushed through the clouds and missed, and a huge fist descended from the sky tilde, boom. Dash, in a burst of violent noise, Golden Lion's body crashed like a cannonball. When Golden Lion was about to fall into the sea, Liu Olan appeared beside him at a faster speed and picked it up. Back on the deck of the Golden Mary, Liu Olan threw the Golden Lion down like a dead dog. Cutie Huchi Tilda. Golden Lion woke up leisurely at this moment, gasped and said, Wait, what do you want to do? Roland smiled. Didn't you say it just now? But the bounty is really attractive Tilda. At this time, Usopp skillfully brought a large bucket of seawater to make a cage. Wait, if my ability is blocked, then several islands in the sky will all fall down. You look like passionate young people, don't you care about the ordinary civilians on those islands? Question mark. Seeing that the person in front of him was serious, Golden Lion hastily let out the last straw. Roland smiled slightly. Oh, since you said so, then you can put those islands down Tilda. Absolutely impossible. Unless you let me go first, I will consider whether to let the civilians on those islands go. As an old Jiang Wu, it is impossible for Golden Lion to hand over his chips to the opponent first. Puff. Liu O Lan laughed. What are you laughing at? Golden Lion couldn't figure out what kind of medicine was sold in Liu O Lan's gourd. I think you are very funny. We are pirates. You actually threatened me with the lives of some irrelevant people? Question mark. A funny expression appeared on Liu O Lan's face. He raised his hand and gave Golden Lion a head, tell me, are you stupid? Golden Lion couldn't refute. After thinking for a while, Liu Olan said again, however, then again dot 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 it's not our style to throw those civilians to death gracefully. I'll give you a chance to land those islands now. It can be guaranteed that you will not be subjected to any abuse before being handed over to Han Jun. Ji ha 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 ha. Suddenly, Golden Lion laughed loudly, in the end. Do you still care about the lives of those people, stupid little rookies? This is your common weakness. Now I will give you a choice, one is to let me go immediately, one is that all the islands that I saw with my own eyes fell down and smashed to pieces. Boom. As soon as Golden Lion finished speaking, Liu Lan grabbed the boat above his head. You like to give others choices, don't you? Then I will give you two choices now. One is to put these islands down safely immediately, and the other is to watch me unplug the rudder above your head. For the threat of the Golden Lion. Liu Lan is not that set. You bastard. Golden Lion may not be afraid of death, but once the rudder plugged above his head is pulled out, he is likely to become an idiot. For an arrogant gangster like him, he doesn't want to become an idiot even if he dies. He was furious immediately. Bastard. Give it a good time and kill me directly. 3. Liu Lan ignored Golden Lion's nonsense and started the countdown anyway. 2. 0. Liu Lan skipped one and received it directly then grabbed the rudder hard and pulled it up, fk, this little bastard is serious, 0.3 is probably because the rudder is too tight, Liu Olan pulls hard and directly lifts up the golden lion, ah, golden lion let out a painful scream tilde, huh, the card is still tight tilde, Liu Olan pouted, stepped on golden lion's shoulder with one foot, and held the rudder with both hands at the same time, this time it should be safe, with that said, he exerted his strength again, stop, I'll let it go dot 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 I'll let it go, still not wanting to become an idiot after all, Golden Lion could only compromise. Really, you old guys like to be self-righteous and think that you have mastered the overall situation. Let me tell you, the future world is the world of young people. With that said, Liu Olan looked at the time, within one minute, bring down all the islands. Otherwise, you will have no chance. Damn. Golden Lion cursed in his heart Tilda. I really want to kill you guy. But under the eaves, I have to bow my head Tilda. Soon, those islands landed in this sea area and took root. And Golden Lion also successfully lived in the seawater cage prepared for him by Usopp and lived with Absalom in the prison cell at the bottom of the cabin. Chapter 172 Little Melly Wants to Eat the Mangrove Tree, Subscribe. A few days later, Going Merry came to say by the archipelago. This can be said to be a paradise for the first half of the Grand Line. Now that we're here, it's time for everyone to have fun and relax. Luffy, Usopp, Chopper, and Kai's elementary school foursome traveled together. Sanji and Zora are friends together Tilda. Frankie and the new Brook duo together. Robin travels alone, looking around Tilda. And Liu Olan brought Nami and Xiamili to Island 60. This is the marine base of the Seibadi Archipelago, where Liu Olan intends to cash out the Golden Lion and Absalom. While the Golden Lion has a huge bounty, don't forget dot 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 this is the Seibadi Archipelago. A large number of bounty hunters gather here all year round making a fortune by catching pirates who want to go to New World. You know, there are at least tens of millions of rewards for the pirates who can come here. If the marine base here does not maintain a bounty pool of more than 1 billion or 2 billion for a long time, it will definitely not be able to support such a large bounty tilde. Stop. Seeing Liu Olan and his party approaching, the marine guard immediately raised his hand, motioning to stop. Hello, we are bounty hunters, in exchange for bounties. Although the reward order for Liu Olan 08 has already been announced, but the three wearing big sunglasses at this time, 
if they are not very familiar people, it is still not easy to distinguish Tilda. Exchanging rewards, hearing this. The marine guard looked around Liu Olan with some differences, then pointed to Nami and Xiaomili. Where are the pirates? Is it the two of them? Of course not. Here they are. Liu Olan smiled lightly, then passed his hand forward. The two Riatsu energies were withdrawn, and the figures of Golden Lion and Absalom emerged. On the way here just now, in order to deceive people, Liu Olan marked the Golden Lion and Absalom with a bent light star, making the two of them invisible. After all, no matter how bleak the Golden Lion's twilight years, its popularity is still very high. Huh? This person, wait. Ah, the Marine Guard suddenly recognized the Golden Lion, and immediately yelled in shock. His exclamation attracted a large number of Marine soldiers, thinking that someone was looking for trouble. What's wrong? What happened? Is someone here to make trouble? The Marine soldiers quickly surrounded Liu Olan Shanran. No, no, no dot 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 that dot 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 that apostrophe s yes, dot 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 Golden Lion. The Marine Guard just now pointed at the Golden Lion in horror and exclaimed, My God, it's really him. Since he escaped from prison 20 years ago, there has been no news about him. Almost everyone thinks he is dead. It's outrageous. It's terrifying to be able to capture this legendary big pirate. After a while, the three of Liu Olan finished the formalities and came out. Nami's two eyes have completely turned into the shape of Bailey, and he kept shouting, I got rich, I got rich. As expected of the marine base closest to naval headquarters, it's really rich. As soon as the two pirates exchanged, Liu Olan's system space has an extra 1.5 billion Baileys. Although the Golden Lion's bounty has shrunk, Liu Olan is already very satisfied. After all, Golden Lion is a windfall. Dad, eat Mew Mew. Just after leaving the island where the marine base is located, Little Millie suddenly pointed to the Yarchman mangrove tree and shouted, Um Tilda, do you actually want to eat the mangroves here? Liu Olan was a little surprised. After subduing the Golden Lion before, Liu Olan specially took Little Melly to board those islands. But what Liu Olan didn't expect was that in those dense forests, there was not a single tree that caught Xiaomili's eyes. Feed her and she won't eat at all. And now, little Melly actually asked to eat the Alchman mangrove. But the problem is Tilda. The entire Sebadi archipelago was born on the roots of the Alchman mangrove. If all the mangroves were eaten, the Sebadi archipelago would cease to exist. But it's rare for little Melly to have a big appetite, can't she be disappointed? Liu Olan thought for a while, and suddenly thought of something. He squatted up and gently pinched little Mealy's face. You want to eat this kind of mangrove tree, right? Okay, be good, Mealy, wait a little longer, and you will be able to collect a lot of mangrove branches in no time. Yeah, daddy is so nice. Hearing Liu Olan's reassurance, little Mealy hugged Liu Olan's side happily and kissed her. Liu Olan looked comfortable and smiled happily. Let's go. Let's go to Island 24 first. There is a May restaurant there. Let's satisfy Xiomai first. I think it's you who want to satisfy your hunger. Right Tilda. Nami walked up to Liu Olan and took his arm. Don't you want to, you little greedy cat? Liu Olan teased. Hate Tilda. Nami pinched Liu Olan's big waist Tilda. Peninsula 34 Tilda. Luffy, you soap. Chopper and Kai are already having fun in the amusement park here Tilda. Peninsula 24 Tilda. After Zara and Sanji came here to eat, they were still lost alone. He held a wine gourd in his hand, and walked forward while drinking without realizing that the surrounding atmosphere was too silent. Obviously there are people all over the street, but everyone is kneeling. Who is that guy? In the crowd, Skutakam and Apu stared wide-eyed, looking at Zora in disbelief. Captain, he is a pirate hunter from East Blue in 847. Beside Apu, a younger brother answered him. Among the other group of people, a polite pirate said in surprise. He walked so swaggeringly in the middle of the road. Does he have any common sense? Beside him, Capone Big frowned. Damn, he's going to cause trouble. Next moment, Zora had already gone face to face with a celestial dragonman Charles Ross who was coming across. Um, St. Charles Ross couldn't believe it. The guy in front of him walked up to him in such a swaggering way. Zora also noticed that someone was standing in front of him. So he immediately put down his wine gourd and looked at St. Charles Ross. What's the matter? Do you want to ask for directions? Nanny? The people kneeling on the ground around were all dumbfounded. They all opened their mouths wide open, like ghosts all panicked and restless. Ask for directions? I asked Nermal next door. St. Charles Ross was about to be blown away by this stupid critic, and he immediately drew his pistol. However, the moment he drew his gun, Zora's aura suddenly changed. The lingering coldness is revealed instantly Tilda. Cantling. He Dao Yi Wen, out of the sheath. Chapter 173 Liu Olan, doesn't this show that you have good marksmanship? Please subscribe. Wanna shoot me? Then you go to hell. Zora is too lazy to care who you are facing. As long as you want to make a move, then my knife will never have any doubts. But at this moment, a figure suddenly jumped out from the side, throwing Zora to the side of the road. This figure can hit Zora, obviously it is not a cat or a dog Tilda. It's one of the supernovas this time, because of the stomach king Ali Bonyang. Big brother, why did you die like this? Did you contradict the Tanlong people? Then you can't blame anyone if you die. Bonnie lay on top of Zora, 
crying loudly. Don't forget to smear a handful of ketchup on Zoro's head. Thanks to Bonnie, otherwise it would have been miserable. That kid seems to be the pirate hunter Zora of Straw Hat Crew. Strange Gunworther said with a sigh of relief. Capone Big was smoking a cigar. I heard that those people are not normal, but who would have thought that they would have the audacity to kill celestial dragons? Hawkins looked like Shizui. He was rescued as a matter of course, because there is no death on his face Tilda. Skilichmanap said with a shocked face. That kid just showed a murderous look. He looks like a beast. Hey, that's an ordinary monster. This kid seems to be the number three in their group and the reward is as high as 320 million baileys. The strange monk Aero Uge grinned, and then said, his strength doesn't seem to be the third place. The spirit of their captain can be seen from Madara. Seeing Zara being thrown to the ground by Bonnie, these supernovas were all relieved, thinking that the crisis was over. In the middle of the road Tilda. Did I hit him? Charles Ross looked at the gun in his hand with some differences, and asked in doubt, why do I feel as if he has dodged it? Shaking his head in confusion, St. Charles Ross was about to leave when he suddenly heard a voice coming from the front. Your feeling is not wrong, it really didn't hit. That's what I said. It really seems to have missed. But dot 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 why did this guy fall down after missing? St. Charles Ross looked at Zora and Bonnie on the ground again, with anger in his tone. I guess, this is probably to show that your marksmanship is accurate Tilda. Liu Oland spread out his hands and said with a teasing smile. Ah. Bastard Tilda. Only then did Zora react from his bewilderment, and pushed Bonnie away who was lying on top of him. He wiped the ketchup on his face and said angrily. What are you doing? This time, everyone is stupid. FK Tilda. Brother dot 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 you are not. Others have already done it for you, so you have to feel uncomfortable in front of the Tanlong people, don't you? Question mark. Bonnie has a skeptical attitude towards life. Was in a mammate toe. Originally, I just wanted to stop the incident that caused Marine Admiral to appear while saving you. But you are not only ungrateful, but also implicated me. If it weren't for the old lady who can change the appearance of her age at will, it would be really troublesome now. Damn. Look at that kid. Won't he still want to attack the Tanlong people? Wait, isn't the guy who exposed them the number two guy on the straw hat crew? PFFT. It's him. A bounty of 370 million baileys is offered to the deputy captain, Liu Lan. What's the matter with their group? They actually exposed their accomplices to the Tanlong people when they were pretending. Are they the accomplices who want to see Tan et al. shoot him? Question mark. Why do I feel that he is more like wanting to see his accomplice beheading the celestial dragon? Worry, seems to be true. A horse rider. Crazy. This horse rider is a bunch of lunatics. When the surrounding pirates were shocked, St. Charles Ross found out that he had been fooled, and he was furious immediately. Damn bastard. How dare you lie to me. Enraged, Charles Ross immediately ordered to the left and right guards, go, capture the two of them. I will turn them into my slaves. Yes, several bodyguards in suits and leather shoes rushed up immediately. Trouble Tilda. Bonnie didn't think much, and immediately jumped into the crowd next to him. Ugh, seeing the existence that provoked the Tanlong people rushing towards them, all the pirates over there exclaimed in fright. But after exclaiming, I found that Bonnie had disappeared. Among the crowd, an old woman knelt tremblingly on the ground. One sword styly shan. Zora disappeared from the spot in an instant, and then appeared behind these bodyguards. Candling. He dow one word into the sheath. Puff, puff, puff. Those bodyguards immediately splashed blood like a fountain, then fell to the ground. Silence. Dash. The whole street suddenly fell into a deathly silence. Crazy. Killing Tan Long's bodyguards in front of the Tan Long people is simply provoking the face of the Tan Long people. Comma. There is a saying that beating a dog depends on the owner. Even if it is a dog raised by the Tan Long people, it is also a dog under the aura of the Tan Long people. Ever since birth, Charles Ross Street Ho has met anyone who dares to disobey him. Not only did he see it today, but he even dared to kill his bodyguard. St. Charles Ross couldn't bear it. He raged. Arsel. Notify naval headquarters to me immediately. Let them send Admiral here. Yes. The only remaining bodyguard beside him immediately took out the phone bug. But before he dialed it out, an arm was placed on his shoulder. What followed was that terrifying aura. Being able to become the bodyguard of the Tan Long people is obviously not a cat or a dog. Their perception of the two is still relatively keen. For example, the guy with his hand on his shoulder now is a terrifying existence. The bodyguard turned his head with a trembling face, and looked at the contented Liu Lan. Liu Lan hurriedly took the phone bug from the bodyguard, and said to the bodyguard, Open your mouth. Due to Liu Lan's strong killing intent, the bodyguard didn't even dare to delay for a second, and obediently opened his mouth. Liu Lan stuffed the phone bug into the bodyguard's mouth, and punched him in the chest. Boom. Grunt Tilda. The phone bug was swallowed by him. You bastard. You are actually with them. Go to hell with me. Charles Ross originally thought that Liu Olan was a good citizen who denounced him, but he was also a daring outlaw. He immediately raised the gun in his hand and shot Liu Olan bang bang a few times. Liu Olan turned a blind eye to this move, and walked directly towards the crowd beside him without even looking at the dead fat pig. A few bullets came chasing Liu Olan, but were blocked by an invisible barrier, 
Not even a single wave appeared. Liu Olan walked to the side and grabbed a pirate on the ground. Ah, the pirate was guilty of being a thief, and suddenly yelled in shock. At the same time, a powerful voice came from the phone bug in his hand. Who are you? Someone attacked the Tanlong people. Are you sure you are not talking nonsense? Apparently, the voice of the marine was on the other end of the phone bug. While the pirates don't necessarily know the naval headquarters phone number, the Sebadi Archipelago's marine base phone number is public. They only need to tell the marine base of Sebadi Archipelago about this matter, and it will naturally spread to naval headquarters. Oh? As a pirate, you actually report to marine? You're really embarrassing us pirates. Liu Olan stretched out his hand and slapped the pirate's face twice, his eyes showing contempt. However, the pirate insisted and shouted, Marine already knows about this. If I were you, run away quickly. He he, are you planning to use Marine Admiral as a backer? Seeing the inexplicable self-confidence that suddenly emerged from this pirate, Liu Olan couldn't help laughing, Gian Wang Zhao. He turned his head, looked at St. Charles Ross, and activated the ability of rubber fruit. With a whoosh, the arm stretched out, and it patted Charles Ross directly on the head. Boom. The air cover that symbolized the identity of the Tanlong people was instantly smashed. The shattered glass pierced Charles Ross Saint's face with blood tilde. Hiss. Dash. When this scene appeared, everyone couldn't help but gasped. F.K. The number three person is just the bodyguard who killed the Tanlong people. This number two person directly slapped Tanlong Rin with blood on his face. Madman. Du Nima is a super madman. At this time, Liu Olan patted the palm of Charles Ross Saint's head, grabbed his hair directly pulled him to him, and then stuffed the phone bug into his mouth, saying, come on, you say it yourself toilet, depend on, all the pirates present have a feeling of wanting to die at this moment, knock me Matilda, you play like this, we will all be dragged to death by you, chapter 174 putting collars on celestial dragons, please subscribe, under Liu Olan's slap, Charles Ross himself was patted like a pussy Tilda, at this time, he was dragged to the front by Liu Olan all of a sudden, and he regained consciousness from the bewilderment, when he realized that he had been beaten by a pariah, St. Charles Ross immediately howled at the phone bug like a pig, I am St. Charles Ross, and a pariah hit me, send me a phone call, come Admiral, after Charles Ross finished speaking, Liu Olan said to the phone bug, just to add, we are now at Peninsula 24, say by the archipelago, don't go wrong tilde, puff, dash, everyone is about to vomit blood tilde, this Nima, are you afraid that the marine admiral will not be able to find the way, at this moment, St. Charles Ross suddenly let out another scream like killing a pig. Everyone wondered what happened, and they didn't see Liu Ogang beating him tilde. However, when everyone's eyes shifted to the bottom, they realized that Liu Olan had stepped heavily on Charles Ross Street's feet. Then, under the shocked eyes of everyone, Liu Olan suddenly stuffed the phone bug into the mouth of St. Charles Ross. Immediately afterwards, tilde, Liu Olan punched Charles Ross in the chest. Grunt tilde, the phone bug went into the stomach of St. Charles Ross so smoothly. Exclamation mark. Everyone is deluded Tilda. This guy seems to be quite keen on feeding phone bugs to others Tilda. St. Charles Ross almost lost his breath when he was punched by Liu Olan, and immediately fell to the ground, clutching his mouth and swimming around Tilda. Liu Olan looked back at the pirate who just made a small report, grabbed his head, and smashed it to the ground with a bang. I don't want to get my hands dirty, so you just lie here obediently and wait for the marine to take you away. But, if you dare to move, I'll let Zara cut you. After saying this, Liu Ogang let go of his hand, and Zora on the side suddenly shouted in a dazed look, Hey, it was obviously you who beat him, why did you let me do it? Liu Olan shrugged his shoulders, I said, This incident was caused by you, it's just that you cut someone down, what a big deal Tilda. Zora thought about it, and it seemed to make sense. Captain dot 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 help me. The pirate who reported just now was lying on the ground and did not dare to move, but he still tried to ask for help. Hearing this, Liu Lan's gaze immediately followed the pirate's gaze. Oh yo Tilda, it turned out to be a guy from the Hawkins Pirates. No wonder I love small reports so much Tilda. According to normal logic Tilda, my younger brother was bullied, as the captain, he should stand out. But in the face of these two lunatics who dared to fight even the Tanlong people, Hawkins didn't want to intervene at all. If the younger brother dies, he will die, but don't he get involved in matters related to Tan Long Run. But at this time, when he heard his younger brother calling him, Hawkins' face turned livid. He has no choice but to stand up, otherwise, A.D., he will not hang around in this sea in the future. Vice Captain of the Straw Hat Pirates, you're a supernova anyway, so don't argue with a fool who doesn't know what's good Tilda. Hawkins faced Liu Olan and confronted him. Hearing this, Liu Olan became interested, rubbed his chin, and said with a smile, Oh exclamation mark Tilda, how can you say that you plan to stand up for him? Hawkins is not a fool, and he can clearly hear a hint of threat in this tone, but, he is not afraid of threats. Instead, he chuckled and said, Vice Captain of the Straw Hat Pirates, 
You don't need to speak to me in such a threatening tone. The divination shows that I won't die today. Really? How about you do the math again now? What's your death rate? Liu Olan raised his eyebrows and teased. Hearing this, Hawkins really counted. However, when the hexagram came out, his face was shocked. Dot. 99.99%? No no no. Toad, I must have miscalculated. He was so scared that he quickly counted again. This time the result is. 0% FK. Hawking suddenly realized something was wrong. He suddenly looked up at Liu Lan. Liu Lan pouted. Do you understand now? Fortune telling is all about predictions. Since it is a prediction of the future, it can be changed at any time. Just like just now, whether you die or not depends only on whether I move or not. Kill your thoughts. A burst of coldness instantly split from the back tilde. In front of Liu Lan, Hawkins felt deeply powerless. You know, all his little brothers are his doubles. To put it bluntly, if one wanted to kill him, one would have to kill him hundreds of times, exhausting all of his younger brother's life, and only then would it be his own life. But even with such a powerful life-saving means, the fatality rate soared to 99.99% at the moment Liu Olan showed his killing intent just now. Horrible. This is absolutely crushing strength. As a supernova, Hawkins never dreamed that the gap between himself and another supernova would be so outrageous. Okay, I see. Hawkins nodded obediently, and he made a gesture of invitation. My little brother is not sensible so I let you clean it up. R? Captain. Hearing this, the pirate lying on the ground cried out in despair. Admiral is coming soon, so I won't accompany you crazy people. Let's go first. With that said, Hawkins left with his pirates. That guy just took people away like this. Even his own crew members are dying. Such a waste is worthy of being the captain. Capone Big took a puff on his cigar, and Dewey spit on the ground. R, blah, blah. It's impossible for that guy not to know this unspoken rule right? But he still chose not to save him. What did he get out of his fortune telling just now? Skillichman Apple looked puzzled. Afterwards, he suddenly realized that Admiral was coming soon, and hurriedly left with his people. The number two person suppressed the captain so much that he didn't dare to resist at all. He was so strong that he had nothing to say. The strange monk or Uj smiled and left. Soon, all the pirates around realized that it was time to escape, and they all scattered. Only the slaves of St. Charles Ross stayed where they were. They also wanted to run. But the collars on their necks made them understand that if they ran, they would die. Liu Olan looked at these slaves. To be precise, he was actually looking at the collars on their necks tilde. An idea popped into his mind. So, he flipped his hand over, and the sword card was in his hand. A sharp sword appeared in his hand. Liu Olan walked towards these slaves. You. What do you want to do? Don't kill us. We won't say anything. Seeing this, the slaves thought that Liu Olan was going to kill him, and immediately begged for mercy. Shut up. With a scolding sound. Liu Olan raised the knife and dropped it. Swipe swipe. After several sword strikes, the collars on these slaves' necks all fell off. Bang, bang. The collar fell to the ground, and the crisp sound of the impact immediately awakened these slaves from the shock. Ah! Not fried. The collar is gone. We are saved. Excited, these slaves ran away. If it was an ordinary sword, then cutting the collar directly like this would definitely explode. But the sword cards of Klaus cards are different. Conceptual cut. I understand everything Tilda. Liu Olan took a look at these collars then at Charles Ross's neck, and finally checked the size visually, and chose a suitable one for Charles Ross. Click. The moment the collar was put on St. Charles Ross's neck. Hiss. Those pirates who were watching while running away took a deep breath. Crazy. Crazy. And these surprised voices also made other people who were only concerned about running away look back curiously. Just one glance tilde. They all opened their mouths wide and their eyes popped out. Put a collar on. Put a collar on the ten long people. This world must be crazy. Chapter 175 Kizaru Strikes. Please subscribe. A H H H. You untouchable. What have you done to me? St. Charles Ross was completely dumbfounded. He tugged on the collar around his neck and roared angrily. Liu Olan raised his hand and slapped him a few times. Facts have proved that the arrogance of Tan Long people can only persist for a few seconds tilde. Woo Dad, my dad will definitely kill you. Charles Ross Street covered his swollen face, wailing and threatening. Crackling tilde. Another few slaps tilde. Charles Ross. Who was swollen into a pig's head, suddenly didn't force forced. Liu Lan ordered, get down on the ground like a slave exclamation mark. What? You, crackling. Without giving Charles Ross a chance to jabber, Liu Lan's slap went up without hesitation. A few seconds later, Charles Ross Street fell obediently to the ground. By the way, aren't you with Sanji? Why are you here alone? Holding the chain of St. Charles Ross, Igan watched as Zora asked. Hearing this, Zora suddenly complained, that guy Sanji, he disappeared after walking, maybe he lost his way. Puff. Liu Olan spit out an old groove. Needless to say, I must have lost my way. Why did you come here alone? It should be Nami and Little Millie with you? Zora asked. Here. Little Mary couldn't see this, so I asked Nami to take her to Island 32 to find Luffy and the others to play. Liu Olan nuzzled his lips to St. Charles Ross who was lying on the ground, 
and said, as soon as he finished speaking, Liu Olan looked at an old woman on the side of the road, I said, do you like to eavesdrop on other people's conversations so much? Ah yes, I'm sorry, it's just inconvenient for me to follow, I'm sorry dot 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 young man, I dot 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 cough cough, I'm leaving now Tilda. The old woman showed a look of fear, and hurriedly staggered, hey, what are you doing? She just has bad legs and feet, she didn't mean to eavesdrop on anything. Zara couldn't stand it anymore, and immediately questioned, yeah? A strange smile appeared on Liu Olan's face, when she threw you to the ground just now. Her heels were so numb Tilda. What nonsense are you talking about? The woman who threw me to the ground just now. A question mark appeared on Zora's head, but then he was taken aback suddenly. Hey, hey, you mean to say that this old woman is the woman just now? Isn't that her Tilda? Leo Lan smiled, then looked at the old woman, and said, Do you think so? Big Gita Bonnie Tilda. Bonnie's devil fruit ability is able to change age, thus changing appearance. Not even observation Haki can tell. When Leo Lan noticed the old woman just now, he guessed that she might be Bonnie. Although Observation Haki couldn't identify it, Liu Olan used the god-killing star Tan Liu Oxing, which is the 77th of Bakudo, and the sky is quite empty. When Riatsu overwrites the past, it is quickly captured that the old woman's soul power is the same as Bonnie's, impossible. How do you know it's me? Hearing that Liu Olan had directly seen through her identity, Bonnie returned to her original appearance and looked at Liu Olan in disbelief. That's not the point. Is it? The point is why did you eavesdrop on our conversation? Liu Olan did not answer Bonnie, but asked rhetorically. I'm just curious about what you guys want to do. You didn't even say that you beat the Tanlong people, but you actually did this kind of thing to the Tanlong people. Bonnie pointed to St. Charles Ross lying on the ground. Even after seeing this incident with her own eyes, she still wondered if she was dreaming Tilda. Suddenly thought of something, Bonnie said again, that's right. You should know that Marine Admiral is coming soon, why don't you run away quickly? I'm holding this pig for a while now. Isn't it just waiting for Admiral's arrival? Liu Olan spread his hands and said, Isn't it? With the strength of the two of you, if you want to escape now, there is a high probability that you can escape. Why do you give up resistance and choose to capture without a fight? While talking, Bonnie nervously paid attention to the movement in the distance from time to time. As long as there is a figure of Marine Admiral, she runs away immediately. What are you talking about? What's being captured without a fight? What's giving up resistance? Zora looked at Bonnie in bewilderment. Does this woman really seem to be out of her mind? Zero dot 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 seeking flowers. Liu Olan also felt speechless in the same way. He thought for a while, then said, I can't blame you Tilda. Question mark. Hearing this, Bonnie also had a question mark on his forehead. What do you mean? Blame me for what? Liu Olan explained, it is really difficult for you to ask a rabbit to think about the lion's question. So, you can't blame you for asking the question just now. Damn it. Bonnie is also considered a smart person and he immediately understood the meaning of Liu Olan's words. Laughing at me as a rabbit? Okay, that auntie will be lurking around in a while, I want to see what you guys use to compete with Admiral. With that said, Bonnie turned around and flashed into the alley. Zora curled his lips slightly, and then looked at Liu Olan, so we are preparing to fight Admiral? I don't know who is here. Could it be that Okiji from last time? Yes, I guess, because of the emergency. Naval headquarters will definitely send Admiral to support at the fastest speed. And the fastest is naturally Kizaru Admiral. Liu Olan analyzed it. Another Admiral? This is not bad. Just to test my strength. Hearing this, Zora's face was filled with fighting spirit. He likes to fight with the strong, especially the strong who has never been in contact with. It is even more exciting. However, Liu Olan poured cold water on him. Don't think too much. We are waiting for Kizaru Admiral here, not to fight him to the death but to use him and get some snacks for little Millie. As soon as these words came out, Zora's fighting spirit suddenly collapsed. Nanny, what dot 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 what do you mean? Listen up, wait for Kizaru to come later, the two of us. Liu Olan whispered to Zora with a very small voice. Just when the two of them had just finished whispering, a golden light shone on the ground not far behind them. The golden light condensed into a human form, and it was Marine Admiral Kizaru. If you like this audiobook, subscribe the channel for more videos like this and join my Patreon if you want to support me. Leave some comment and let me know if you guys like this story, or you have a web novel you like and want to hear its audiobook. I will be happy to create them for you. Please like, share, and leave a comment on the video.